In today's video, whoa, Sonny, why are you so giant? Because we're playing giant versus tiny hide and seek. Hey, that's not fair. You can see everything from up there. Yes, I can. I can also see this huge subscribe button. Hit that like and subscribe button so Sonny doesn't find me in these roses. Welcome to the big city, Melon. Today we're playing hide and seek in the largest city of Minecraft. Bro, this place is huge. I can't wait to hide. And I can't wait to track you down because I'm going to transform into a giant. Yeah. Oh my goodness. All right, Sonny, give me my two minutes to hide. Okay, Melon, good luck hiding. But just remember, as a giant, I have x-ray vision and can detect heat anywhere. So you better run far so I can't squish you. Ah, I gotta go chill. I have no chill. You gotta start counting or you're cheating, Sonny. Fine. One, two, three. Okay, goats, check this out. He wants me to go really far, but instead, I'll go really close because he's probably gonna blitz out of here and not even check his nearby surroundings. I'm gonna go to the top of this building. It's even bigger than Sonny as a giant. So if he doesn't look up, he won't see me. Man, this is, this is a lot of stairs. This building is huge. There we go. I've made it to the rooftops. And now check this out. I can see Sonny from here. Okay, he's got some kind of giant vision. So I've gotta be careful and pray he doesn't look up at me. 100 times up. All right, I'm ready, Sonny, so it's perfect. Let's go. All right, goats, as a giant, let me see if I can locate Melon's position. <laughs> I just went to look at myself because I thought it'd be a good shot. But look over my shoulder. Melon's on that building's rooftop. Okay, let's see here. I wonder where you're hiding. Let me check my x-ray vision. See if there's any heat signatures. Oh no, I can't find him. Check it out. My plan's working perfectly. He's running away. And then I just got to loop around this way, goats. And it's time for me to get small and enter the building. Man, he went really far that way. I haven't seen him since. Okay, he's just at the tippity top of this skyscraper. Let me find the entrance and start staircasing up. Or I'll just make my own entrance. Melon, it's only a matter of time until I find you. I don't know about that, Sonny. I'm looking out there and I don't see you anywhere. I know, bro. I ran out to the edge of the city. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. So let me just ask my first question. Are you inside or outside? I am outside, Sonny. Not that that's gonna help you very much. Okay. Second question. Are you using a building to hide or are you just in a forest or a park? I would say I'm using a building. Okay, that's interesting. Would you say you're at a place of high or low elevation? <laughs> I'd say I'm pretty high up here. Goats, look at him. He's just standing on the edge of the building. Check this out. Three, two, one. Melon! Found you! Ah! Ah! Wait, you lived? I can't be having that. No, no. Yeah! I won the first round. Okay, bro, I get it. You won, but why'd you have to kill me? Because you were standing on the edge of the building. I thought it'd be funny. <sighs> I'll remember that, Sonny. When I'm huge and seeking. Ah! I gotta get out of here. Melon's a giant. And I have a glass sword with your name on it. Uh, Melon, please don't hit me with that thing. It's gonna shatter over my head and get me a lot of glass splinters. Exactly. And then you'll die. Oh, no. He's an absolute... Absolute madman. I've got to find the best hiding spot possible so he doesn't see me. And I know just the place. Check this out. It's the globe of planet Earth. All I need is to put these goggles on and look at all the secret entrances. I think I'm going to go in through here. Oh, yeah. And look at it. It's one way glass. I can use this globe to spy on the giant Wandermelon and watch his every move. I actually don't even need these goggles anymore. Melon, I'm ready. And I'm ready to find you, Sonny. I've just got to walk around this massive gargantuan city. Yeah, good luck with that, bro. Even though you have heat detection x-ray vision, you're not going to find me. We'll see, because I also have three questions to help track you down. Question numero uno. Are you at high, low, or medium elevation? This way I know what level to angle my camera. So? 
does low elevation mean underground? What does that mean? No, like, like, uh, I mean, like ground level or below. Okay, I'm on ground level or below then. I'm on low elevation. You had low elevation? Okay, so I guess I'll look down the whole time. Then, Sonny, for my second question. <gasps> Guys, there he is. I could see his big head run past these buildings. Um, are you, uh, I guess there's no point in asking if you're inside or outside because I have heat detection. Instead, let's think of a better question. Have you seen me in the past minute? Yeah, I watched you run past the construction site. Oh, thanks for the extra tips. All I've got to do is head back to the construction site and it's guaranteed that I can find you somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck with that one. Don't see you though. Oh wait, there's a lot of construction sites. Huh. Sonny, where are you? Nowhere. Uh, I don't want you to find me, bro. I know you're nearby. There he is. He's right behind the crane. And look what I found here. I see a glowing Sonny. This is bad, but at least as a giant, he won't be able to enter the globe. He's gonna have to shrink down. Let me on this globe. What are you gonna do crush it because you're so huge no sonny i'll shrink down and goats i'll put the goggles on and make the escape it's over for you sonny i'm coming in oh no he's breaking that block i gotta go yeah uh what the heck where did you go and what is this place <laughs> Guys, look at Melon. There he is. Sonny, I know you're around here somewhere. You can't get away from me. This glass sword has your name on it. Melon, I'm pretty sure I escaped you. Plus, you only got one minute left. Oh, Sonny, I swear if you actually win once I found you, there's got to be something about this place. Like a secret exit. Come on, there's got to be ghost blocks somewhere. <gasps> Guys, he literally just stepped on my face. He didn't see me. Where are are you? I'm so confused. Goats, I'm gonna mess with him and start breaking blocks on the wrong part of the globe. I just heard a glass break. Where did that just happen? I'm so confused, but there's no glass broken. Now check this out. I'll start punching this. Wait, what the heck? Why is this block breaking? Sonny! Bro, you have 30 seconds left. That's it. Let me out. Let me out. Ah, guys, I just saw a block break. Sonny, I know you're out here somewhere. Where are you? Ah! Get back here, Sonny! No, 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 no. You'll never take me alive. Will I? Will I never really? Wait, where'd you go? You just disappeared. I'm actually the goat. Ten seconds left. Where are you? Here, I'll give you a hint. I'll give you a hint. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I can hear steps. Wait, goggles of true vision? No way! What is this? Three! Two, one, I win, I win! No! Actually, I'm pretty sure I won that. Whatever, bro. We'll let the viewers decide. Who do you think won that round of hide and seek? Sunny or Melon? Now, brother, it's your turn to hide once again. And I must return to my gigantic form. Oh, yeah. Oh my goodness, Sonny, you're huge. But you forgot about one thing. You gave me these goggles of true vision. Now I can see every secret on the map. Oh yeah? What about this secret? <laughs> I'm even more huge. Calm down, Sonny, you're getting too big. Relax. Get out of here. I am, just leave me alone. I need to find an ultimate secret hiding spot. I won't rest until I discover one. One hour later. Man, I've been searching through like every room of this building. There's gotta be a secret somewhere. <sighs> Whoa, what the heck? There's a pool. And not only that, there's also hidden ghost blocks underneath the pool. I wonder what's down here. No way. A secret melon base. That's awesome. This is perfect. And I even have cameras to spy on Sunny. All right, Sunny, I'm ready. And I'm ready to find you. First things first, I've got to channel my thermal vision. <laughs> Ah, now I can detect your heat signature anywhere in Minecraft. I just gotta get close enough. Where are ya? I know you're around here somewhere. Do you really, Sonny? Yes, you probably went to the bank because you're trying to steal some diamonds. Dang it, you're not in the bank, seriously? Okay, Melon, first question. How far from the counting area did you go? I would say pretty dang far, Sonny. Dang 
following you, Melon. That means you're on the outskirts of town somewhere. Ugh. And you're not at the fast food area. I see McDonald's. I see KFC. Even Walmart's here. But I don't see the watermelon. Guys, he's literally nowhere near me right now. This is amazing. Yo, look at the shipping docks. This place looks awesome. Second question, Melon. If you're far away, somewhere on the outskirts of the city, I've got to ask if you are hiding on a yacht. There's a lot of these boats. No, I am not, Sonny. I can assure you that much. Dang it. That would have actually been such a goaded question if you were. Okay, okay. Last question. Are you hiding in a hotel? Uh, why would you ask that? Yes, I am, Sonny. Because there's a lot of buildings, but not many of them are hotels. Just gotta track down some hotels, and you'll be inside of one of them. Bruh, but I can't find you. I'm not getting a heat signature anywhere. Yes, that's perfect, Sonny. Ugh. I'm about as far on the outskirts of the city as possible. It's literally turning into a glitched highway. What is this? Okay, gotta climb back up, follow the edge. Where is this leading to? Look what I found here, guys. Oh, goats. Sonny, he's on to me. He's looking at my heat signature right now. The Hotel Grand. Oh, <laughs> just what I've been looking for. A hotel. Time for me to shrink down and find you. This still should be my safest spot. There's no way he'll know that I'm hiding beneath ghost blocks. Now, Melon should be approximately on floor floor two or three inside of the hotel. Let's stroll in. How am I supposed to get to the second floor? He should be right above me. Hey, Sonny, you're running out of time. One minute left. That's fine, bro. I know where you're hiding. I just don't know how to get there. How do I call for this elevator? Ah, uh, there's gotta be another way up. Oh, the hotel is made of ice. Therefore, when I break the blocks, it allows me to swim. Oh, yes, but indeed. Dang it, it's not that helpful. I think I need to build. Time to gather some logs. That should be enough. And planks. Let's go. Melon, it's only a matter of time now. Did you hear that glass breaking? Uh, no. I don't even hear you. You're nowhere near me. Plus, you only have 30 seconds left. You're telling me you don't hear this door? No, I, I don't hear anything, actually. Oh, no. Guys, my depth perception was a little off. I swear he was on this floor. Maybe he's on floor three. We've got to get a little higher up. Yes, that'll do. Uh, Melon, I know you're around here somewhere. Guys, he just opened a door near me. I'm a little bit sketched. Sunny, 10 seconds left. What the heck, bro? You really don't hear these doors. Uh, now I do. But five, four, three, two, one. You've got to be here. Hey, Sonny, your time's up. What the heck, bro? Where are you? Uh, I'm right in the pool, bro. I've just been chilling. What do you mean the pool? This was here the whole time? How did I miss this? You big old fool. I knew my glowing effect would throw you off because I was deep below. What? There's a secret room under the pool? No wonder I couldn't find you. I was on the wrong floor of the hotel. Exact, Amungo. And I was spying on you the whole time. Are you kidding me? Dang it! Anyways, this is a pretty good spot for me to count, Sonny. So your two minutes starts now. <sighs> How do I get out of here? Bro, stop spying on me. Get rid of those secret cameras. All right, fine. Fair's fair. But now your two minutes actually start, Sonny. Start the countdown, Melon. But, uh, how do you get out of this room? Uh, one, two. No, no, Melon, how do I get out of here? Four. You gotta figure that out yourself, brah. Can I just jump off the couch? Are you kidding me? Whatever, I'm free. Twelve. 13, 14. Oh no, goats. I already lost a lot of time. I gotta make moves. Even if this kills me. That's actually way better. Now I'm super far from Melon. Uh, where should I hide though? Melon did a secret spot in a swimming pool. I need to come up with something good myself. Wait, what is this? <gasps> Elytra! Let's go! Give me wings! And fireworks. Yes, I can fly. Fly! All right, there's no way Melon's finding me. I'm gonna go super, super, super duper high 
fly up. And I think I'll probably just hide inside of an airplane. This looks pretty epic. Oh no, I didn't stick the landing. Let's try that again. Perfect. And then I simply sneak inside. Yes, I'm in. I'm the captain now. And time's up, Sonny. I'm coming to get you. First, I've got to escape this building and then get huge. It's time to get big. Ow. You got too big, bruh. Your ego killed you. Yeah, I tried to jump from way too high. But now, I'm huge, Sonny. And I'm gonna find you. Now, Sonny, for my first question, how far did you walk from that last place we were? I didn't walk too far because when I jumped out of the window, I died. Oh, I died too. That means I spawned here, which means you must be hiding nearby. Hmm. So for my second question, are you hiding at a place of high or low elevation? Why would you ask that? Uh, because, dude, there's buildings that are super tall. Oh, yeah, yeah. Totally just really big, tall skyscrapers. You're right. Uh, I'm at a place of high elevation. High, so I should be angling my camera very, very high. Yes, of course. Hmm. <clears throat> Sonny, I'm not seeing you in any buildings. I'm kind of confused. Look at how big he is. He's huge. Maybe I got to make myself a little bit bigger to find you. No, Melon, Melon, don't get any bigger. Don't do it. Oh my goodness. I still feel like I'm too small. Melon, if you go any bigger, you might explode. Oh, uh, I still feel like I'm too small, Sonny. Bro, you're taller than most of the buildings. Relax, I can see you. Don't get any bigger. You're going to crash the game. Okay, I'm starting to lag a little bit, but I don't see you up here anywhere. I feel like you're capping a little bit. Melon, just use your brain and try and figure it out. And get even bigger? No! No, don't do it! Don't do it! Guys, his head pretty much inside of this airplane, but I think he lagged his game. All right, I'm too laggy, Sonny. I gotta get small. <laughs> You call that small? You're still a giant. Yeah, but I was glitching so hard. Guys, he has no clue I'm up here in this airplane. Now, Sonny, for my third and final question, are you near the place we died? Yes. Wait, the place we died or the place we respawned? The place we respawned. Yes, I'm near the spawn point. Okay, that's good and all, but I don't see you. I don't understand. I'm looking everywhere. Hi. Wait a second. Hi, Sonny. You're in an airplane. How the heck did you even get up there? I don't know what you're talking about. I am actually not in an airplane. I'm not. Yeah? Yeah, you're not? That's okay. I'm gonna do some crazy parkour, guys. Check this out. How, though? How am I supposed to parkour? Maybe I need to get on the tippity top of that building. Guys, if I meditate hard enough, I should be able to levitate. No! You can't use levitation powers! That's not fair! Hmm! Hmm! Oh, no. Giants, they have the ability to detect thermal radiation through heat. And they can levitate! Hmm! Hey, Sonny! Wait, no. Uh, stop him! Stop the him! Stop the him! Bro, you meditated too hard! But I'm coming down, Sonny, and I'm gonna get ya! No, bro, you're just gonna splat. Dang it! But technically, I did just touch you right there, Sonny. Uh, did you? Do you have any evidence of that? You're kind of dead. Bro, I totally got you there. Are you kidding me? Nah, bro. You weren't even close. Also, you got 20 seconds left. Good luck. That's it. I'm coming up there, Sonny. I'm coming up there. Bro, I don't even see you. What are you talking about? My levitation. It's working very slowly. Very, very slowly. Hold on. Hold on. Let me try this again. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Melon, that's not gonna work. You're not a giant. You don't know me, Sonny. Mmm. 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 Oh, no, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Oh, no. Oh, he's dead again. Bro, that is just sad. Well, I guess that makes me the winner of this hide and seek. Well, Sonny, I guess you win. But everybody watching can win, too, by pressing that like and subscribe button. Today in Minecraft, I shrunk down to the size of one pixel in order to prank my friend Melon. I swear I just saw a little yellow bug that looked suspiciously like Sunny. <laughs> Subscribe right now to make Melon mad. Dang it! Who unplugged my computer? Yes! Finally, Melon! We found a desert pyramid! Bro, I dibs diamonds. I dibs diamonds. Fine, you can have the diamonds. I dibs the rest of the loot. If there's any notch apples, they belong to me. Dang it! 
shit, I should have called that too. Yeah, you can't just take all the loot. Wait, 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 be careful, be careful. We gotta do this really intelligently, okay? Okay, I'm going in. No, Mallet! Don't do that! Ow, you do damage, chill. I know, I gotta dig down the sides and disable the pressure plate. I don't want us to mess this up. And hold on. Okay, it's safe. TNT. I call the TNT. Let's loot! Oh, gunpowder, I'll take that. Ooh, saddle, yeah. Here we go. Iron. Come on, diamonds. Golden apple! Golden apple! Oh! Dang it! Wait, what is that? What are you holding, Sonny? I got the gold, the emeralds. And what do you mean, what am I holding? Bro, what is that sword? Giant sword! Yo! Crazy! This is crazy! All right, I gotta get out of here. I gotta see how big this is. Bro, wait, 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 wait for me. Wait for Fine, you know what? I'll water bucket out. Yeah, water bucket out. <laughs> no, no! Chill! I'm good. I'm in water. I'm chilling. Yeah, I regret everything. Oh, yeah, we're fine. Sonny, you're so annoying. Dude, I was just getting building blocks. Look how many I have now. Hey, fine. Dude, don't make me do it. You know what? I'm doing it. <laughs> you can't hit me, buddy. Yeah. Ow! How did you hit me? Ow! Yeah, it's a giant sword. Bro, that sword is OP! Chill! Chill, chill, Sonny. I'm on two hours. Two hours. Chill, chill. Yeah, then let me up first. Now, let's see just how big this sword it is. Yo, it's huge. I can't even see the whole thing. Dude, that thing is massive. Can you hit me from there, Sonny? Eh, no, but from here. Ow, ow, chill, 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 relax, relax. Don't make me. No, calm down, calm down. I'm very calm and uh, don't shoot me again. You actually almost killed me. <laughs> oh, it would be a shame if I killed you and took that awesome giant sword that's super awesome. Yeah, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Ow, 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 ow. Die. Well, Melon, that adventure Adventure was awesome. Now I gotta go put my sword away. Wanna know where Sonny's putting his... <laughs> hey, Sonny. What's up? Hey, how are you? I'm just trying to find the front door. I forgot where it is. Bro, it's this way, silly. It's this way. I know, I know. Guys, should I put my giant sword in the mailbox? No, that's too obvious. Melon will find it for sure. And I'll bait him out with some gunpowder. I wonder if he put his giant sword in here. Dang it! Just gunpowder. But I'll take it. Guys, I'm gonna put it up here. Time to set the passcode. Let's go with one... Two, three, five. He'll never suspect it. And put my giant sword and golden apples safely away. Hey, Melon, what show are you watching? Uh, I'm watching the channel about the void. It's about the void in Minecraft. Yeah, this looks really boring, bro. There's nothing on the TV. Yeah, that's what the void is, Sonny. It's it's just the void. Dude, this guy is so deep in the void. Isn't that awesome, though? Wow, really cool, really cool. I, I'm going in the kitchen, bro. I'm done with you. I'm gonna make some food. I know he put his sword somewhere up here. He probably put it in his chest. Okay, just gotta crack his password. One, two, three, four, five. No. One, two, five, six, nine. Six, nine, six, nine. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. What the heck could it be? Uh, uh, one, two, three, five. Yo! It worked! Giant sword. This is awesome. And now, it's time to store it in my very own chest, okay? Put in my code <laughs> that Sonny will never be able to guess. And boom, the perfect crime. Guys, I'm hearing some noise upstairs. What's going on, Melon? I'm just watching the void. Were you just upstairs? No, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just watching the void. It's really cool. Like, this guy's at 10,000 blocks now. Yeah, really cool. Really cool void. No, no, Sonny, stop! Okay, Melon, question for you. Do you want to go on another adventure so you can get your own giant sword? Maybe we'll find a giant diamond sword. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay, I'm going to go get my weapon and then we'll roll out. Wait, 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 Sonny, Sonny, Sonny. You don't need to grab your weapon. We don't want to risk losing it, right? I mean, if I have it, there's no way I can lose it. I'll be too strong and powerful. Are you sure? Are you sure? Where did it go? Melon, did you take my giant sword? Uh... Nope. Okay, guys, I don't totally believe Melon. <laughs> So I'm gonna go to the fridge and grab what every good refrigerator holds, the code breaker. And let's go see if he's telling the truth. Hey, Melon, you don't mind if I take a look at your chest, do you? Uh-huh. You can't get in my chest, Sonny. You don't know my passcode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't need to know your passcode. <laughs> Open up! Open up! I mind! I mind! Guys, Melon stole my sword. He took it and lied to me! It's fine. I'll pretend I never noticed. Yeah, everything seems to be in order, Melon. Nothing unusual upstairs. Our chest 
dress look perfectly fine. Wait, really? Perfect. Awesome. <laughs> sweet, 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 sweet. So let's uh, let's go on this adventure, right? Let's go. Yeah, just give me a sec. I gotta go do something quick. Uh, you get a head start and tame the horses for us, okay? All right, I got you. You shall be my steed and I shall call you Horse Muscle. Okay, here we are at Quandale Dingleberry's shop. And let's see what type of loot he has today. Yeah, what up, Dr. Quandale? My guy's been studying. Congratulations on your new title. You seem so much more official. And oh, he doesn't want to talk. Okay. So, Quandale, now that you're a doctor, do you have any cool items for sale? Wait, you have a shrinking potion? That's perfect. I could use that to prank Melon. How much is it going to cost me? You want diamonds? Netherite? You want my giant sword? How'd you even hear about that? Oh, it was your desert pyramid. Oh, sorry about that, Quando. Yeah, seems like a fair trade. I took it out of the chest anyways, but Melon wasn't looking. Here you go. And now where's that little shrinking potion? Oh, there it is. Tiny shrinking potion. Just gotta splash this on myself. Boop. Yo! I'm so tiny! Oh, this is gonna take forever to get anywhere, isn't it? I am so slow. Oh, what the heck? My horse just pooped on me. Let me go take a shower. Oh, sorry, horse. Yo, guys, I heard Mello just talking about needing to shower. So I got myself way up in the bathroom, and just before he activates the shower, I'll swap the water out to TNT. Oh, this is actually disgusting. It's not fertilizer poop. It's the gross kind that hurts you and is disgusting and gross. Come to think of it, most poop is actually gross when it's on you. Okay, take a shower and forget this ever happened. Oh, guys, there he is. He's about to turn the shower on. Just gotta swap this out. Perfect. Now all I need is a nice relaxing shower. What the heck? No, it worked. It actually worked. Oh, I just barely survived. What was that? My bathroom is ruined! Dude, I gotta fix up this house! This is so annoying. Yo, Melon has no idea that I'm spying on him right now. Oh, I'm getting pretty hungry rebuilding this bathroom. Can't wait to get some food after I'm done. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be awesome. Doesn't look too shabby. Guys, Melon just said he wants to get some food soon. I gotta go set up the fridge with some pranks. Gotta make a run for it! This go here? No, I don't think so. Where did this thing go? I'm going as fast as I can! Kitchen! Kitchen! Kitchen, kitchen, here it is. And then I gotta make my way into the fridge. Yes, I made it into the fridge. And I've got all these items to troll melon. Oh, is this some rabbit stew? Time to make it curse. Yes, this is gonna be the weirdest rabbit stew ever. And let's see what's on the next shelf of the fridge. What do we have here? Oh, this looks like a giant cake. It'd be a real shame if these were to be replaced with lava. Oh, yes. Oh, Melon, when you eat this cake, you're in for it. It's gonna be hot. Oh, and what's this over here? Oh, a little cup of water. Oh, if he gets thirsty, poor guy. I'm turning it into fake water. It's gonna poison him. Yes. And I wonder what's up here on the third shelf. Oh, a wandermelon and a baked potato. Well, time to make this into a poisonous potato. Boom, boom. That worked beautifully. Now when Melon takes a bite out of this, it's gonna make him so nauseous. And what to do with this precious watermelon? I think I know just the thing. I'm gonna fill it with TNT. Yes, when he goes to check up on it, it'll explode. Oh, this is where it goes. And I'm done. Man, I am starving. Time to go eat. Do, do, do. What is in the kitchen fridge? Guys, I hear Melon coming. I gotta go. I gotta go. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Give me food. Give me food. What's in the fridge? Guys, I got out of the fridge just in time. Melon's here. <sighs> I don't even care. Poison this potato? I don't care. I'll eat it. Oh, I'm starving. Ow! 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 Okay, it's gone. It's gone. It's okay. I satisfied my hunger a little bit. Melon? No way I'm eating a melon. There's no chance. Oh, uh, I'll eat some cake. That sounds good. And I'll have some water to wash this down. Where do I want to eat this delicacy? I think right here should do the trick. And boom! Guys, he's about to eat the cake. This is gonna be hilarious. Ooh, I can't wait to try this cake. Give me a slice! Oh, delicious. What's happening? Why? Why? What? <laughs> 
It actually worked. Melon just cooked himself in lava. Ever seen that before? A hot lava cake. I guess that's kind of normal. That's like a chocolate fondue cake. Yeah, I guess. But not like this. Not like this one. What was that? Oh, oh, I gotta put this out now. I gotta put this out now. Oh, oh, oh. Go, go away, lava. Go away. Go away. Don't destroy my beautiful kitchen. Oh, oh. Never again am I eating cake. What the heck? Well, at the very least, I can enjoy this water. What the heck? What is happening? Why am I poisoned? Why? Why? Oh, oh. Okay, there's gotta be something I can do. Think about it calmly. Think about it calmly. Okay, if I get some milk from a cow, I can survive. Please. Please! Wait, poison doesn't kill you. I'm actually good! I'm good! Dude, why is everything in that fridge so cursed? That's it. I'm getting something from the other fridge. Maybe this just wasn't turned on or something, but this one definitely is. Ooh, rabbit stew. Sounds delicious. And I need this to heal. Guys, Melon's about to eat the rabbit stew. I don't even know what's gonna happen with this one. I made it so cursed. Time to feast. Nom, 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 nom. Ow! What was that? Big Man Melon was slain by the killer bunny. What the heck? What do you mean, killer bunny? What do you mean, killer bunnies? That doesn't even make sense. Oh my god! There's so many! Wait, why am I even getting hit? Okay, I gotta take these rabbits out. You are pests! You're all- Ow! Final rabbit. Yes! Well, I know what I'm eating tonight. Fresh rabbit. No way I'm eating anything out of these fridges. Time to go and grill. Yo, goats, check it out. Melon's coming outside to use his barbecue grill. And I'm just hiding in the grass. So puny. One pixel tall. He has no clue what's about to happen. This grill is awesome! And now I'm just gonna light a few of Melon's cows on fire! Bird! 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 Oh! And then I'm activating lightning TNT! I'm out of here! Ah! Wait, what's happening? No! Not my cows! No! What happened? Ow! 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 What happened to all my cows? What the heck? They've all been electrocuted! And now while Mel is distracted, I'm gonna pay his grill a little visit. Oh, he's trying to make some cooked rabbit, is he? Well, he's got another thing coming! Take my big sword. You think you could just get away with that? Think again. TNT. TNT. And goodbye. Run away! What's happening? What's happening? What the heck? Why are there more explosions? No. Not my grill! Are you kidding me? That was my pride and joy. That was my baby. How am I gonna eat? I'm starving. Drive by. And now, guys, I'm gonna just nod his ankles a little bit. <laughs> ow, ow, what the heck was that? Wait, something came in the mail. What's this? A book and quill. Is this for me? Dear Melon, I think you are the most handsomest, smartest, funniest, handsomest melon ever. Oh, I thank you. Would you like to go on a date with me? Wait, who's this from? From Melanie. Wait, Melody's asking me on a date? Dude, I gotta get ready. I gotta get ready. Yo, what the heck, guys? Melon just got an invitation for dinner with Melanie, his one true love. He's got such a crush on that watermelon. I gotta get to that place first and prank it. I gotta be quick. I gotta be quick. Okay, guys, I made it to the diner in time. And if you see on the roof, there's a little block of TNT. And everything underneath that is made of ghost blocks. So if I take this little flame bow and I shoot the TNT, it should fall through the roof and blow up Melanie, ruining Melon's date and killing his crush. I know it's a little evil, but you gotta do what you gotta do. It's my villain arc. <laughs> Guys, the sun's about to set. It's so beautiful out here. So romantic. Melon should be here any second for his date. And I've arrived. Where is Melanie? I bet you she's looking gorgeous today. <laughs> Yo, guys, Melanie just went in the restaurant. Oh, Melanie, you're looking glistening today. You're so beautiful. Have I ever told you that? Guys, this is so cringe. I can hear him from all the way over here. Hey, I got a joke for you, Melanie. What, what do you call the difference between the inside of a watermelon and the outside of the watermelon? Uh, one's inside the rind. <laughs> I gotta ruin this date right now. That was too cringe. And please hit. Oh, uh, I was a little bit off. Here we go. Oh, a little bit off. Uh, 
I might just burn down the restaurant instead, huh? Oh, there we go. Man, and I just get lost in your... Wait, what happened to your face? What? I survived, but Melanie was exploded. No! All I have left is her beautiful face. Guys, that worked out perfectly. Look at the restaurant. The whole thing's exploded. Why are there ghost blocks? And what caused that? Somebody is pranking me, and I don't like it. <laughs> oh, she's gone. I miss her so much. Yo, guys, look at Melon. He's just crying and eating ice cream. He's such a baby. Oh, this prank was perfect. <laughs> Come to think of it, I haven't seen Sunny in a while. Yo, guys, look at this trash TV show he's watching. This looks so boring. Oh, uh, uh, my potion. No, it wore off. Sunny, what happened? You just grew into existence. Uh, I was just, uh, I was over in the kitchen and I was gonna ask you if you wanted something to eat. You've been pranking me this whole time. Die. You killed Melody. You killed Melody. I can make it up to you. I have diamond ores. I have diamond ores. Okay, but I don't even have a pickaxe to mine that. It's fine. There's a pickaxe up in my password protected chest and it's really cool and giant. It's totally worth it and I'm so sorry about Melanie. You go first. You go first. Okay, I'm, I'm upstairs. Chill. And now I will unlock your chest. Yeah, and then you wonder why I was pranking you. Ooh, you do have a giant's pickaxe. This is pretty nice, Sonny. I told you it was goaded. Now just chill out for a second, okay? I'll put the diamond ores down. They're all for you. Diamonds? No! Sonny! You thought! You thought! I would just give you diamonds after that. You stole my giant sword, lied about it, and then you hacked my chest again and took my big pickaxe. This is what you get. You're a dead man, Sonny. You're a dead man. Am I? Am I really? What if I, what if I, oh, I am dead. Today in Minecraft Hide and Seek, I'm really small. And I'm huge. Hey, Sonny, where are you hiding, little tiny man? Melon is so scary when he's this big. His footsteps make everything shake. <laughs> Fear me! Good thing he'll never find me hidden inside of this secret subscribe button. Press it right now. Whoa, Melon! Did you get that text from Quandale too? Dude, he has a brand new laboratory and he wants us to check it out! Bro, let's head to Quandale's right away. I can't wait to see what's in his new lab. I bet you he's got a crazy new sheep and an awesome super iron golem. Melon, he always has that in his lab. That's not new. Wait, really? Yeah. Yes, Melon, dude. Look, you could see the iron golem outside. Oh, yeah, you're right. Quandale, we got your text, bro. What's happening? Whoa, he's a doctor now? He must have gotten his doctorate. Wow, Melon, great observation. Actually, I have a PhD, and I also have some very exciting news to share with you. I'm opening my new laboratory, and you guys are going to be the first people to step inside and help me out. Oh, Quandale, that's so cool. Where is it? I want to check it out. Well, you two are going to have to be just a little bit more patient since right now it's still under construction so the location is top secret oh come on quandale we really wanted to see your lab yeah come on tell us where it is i want to check out all the new gadgets and gizmos and slap melon with them no you two are too immature to play around in my lab until i put the proper security protocol in place dang it Ah, oh, melon whatever bro i'm going home yeah 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 sonny We've got to find his lab. <laughs> <laughs> Melon, I don't care about finding his stupid lab anymore. I just want to go home and play video games. Yeah, that's what I'm going to... Ah! What is this? Whoa! Melon, where are we? Sonny, I think we're at Quandale's secret lab. Dude, that was the weirdest dropper I've ever experienced. I kind of have a small headache. I'm nervous about this place. Sonny... This place is awesome! What is all of this stuff? I don't know. I don't think we should mess with any of it, though, Melon. Quandale did say this lab is still under construction. Yeah, don't mess with any of it, yeah. Dude, what is this place? Sonny, none of these levers even do anything. That's probably for the best. What if you had, uh, 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 disabled all netherite in Minecraft or deleted all the diamonds? That would be the worst day ever. Yeah, whatever. What's down the main hallway? I don't know, Sonny. I don't know. This place is kind of giving me the creeps. What does that sound? 
uh, where's that sound coming from? It's not up here. Sonny, I think the sound's coming from this room. You're right, bro. What is this place? I don't know, but Quandale seems to have secured this room very thoroughly. He's got a crazy generator that must be powering all these lasers. Sonny, bro, you're an idiot. This is clearly a drilling centrifuge multiple neon piece universal buster. Oh, sorry. How silly of me. You're right. And come to think of it, those blocks we saw at the start with the on-off switches look like they correspond to these security laser beams. I think you're right, Sonny. Stay here. I'm gonna flick some switches. Okay, let me know when you're in the room and I'll call it out if it works. Guys, how could I be so stupid? I should have known this was a centrifuge neon genesis gal galaxy buster. Whatever Melon said. Okay, Sonny. I'm gonna start with this iron block. I'm turning it off! It worked! You deactivated the first laser beam! Sweet, Sonny. Now, I'm gonna disable this emerald block. Yeah! It worked! The emerald lasers are down, too! Can you just flick all of them now? Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Disable, 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 disable. It worked! You depowered the entire security system! Now, what's this funky item? Oh, the size changing device. It's gonna be all mine! Wait, Sonny, I want the size-changing device. Too bad, it's mine. No, it's mine. No, it's mine. No, it's mine. Yo, you can't just steal it from me. <laughs> I just did, Sonny. Give it back, give it back. No, no, I won't give it back. I refuse, I refuse. That's it, Melon. There's only one fair thing we can do. I challenge you to hide and seek, and the winner gets to keep the size-changer. Oh, you're on, Sonny. Melon, we're in the hide hide and seek arena and take a look at this place it's humongous sunny the rules are simple the seeker is allowed to use this size changer device to become big or super tiny to find a little hider well in that case i'm hiding first gotta go guys i gotta go it's time to become huge uh melon melon you need to relax bro <laughs> whoa Dude, I'm scared now. You're way too intimidating. Good luck hiding, Sonny. Guys, I don't need luck. All I needed was this elevator. Check it out. Boop. Yes. Yes. Uh, actually, on second thought, it's really scary up here. I'm going back down. Yeah, let's climb inside of this. There's no way Melon will be able to find me. He's way too big. And then there should be a good hiding spot here. Like, perhaps up this elevator. Yeah, this looks cozy. And now I'm going to go hide inside of this structure. Melon will never guess that I'm in here. Yes. Yes. Melon, I'm ready. You ready, huh, Sonny? Well, I'm ready. And I'm super fast and strong. Yeah, well, I'm super well hidden. So this first round's gonna be an easy dubski. Are you sure about that, Sonny? Yeah, like 99.99% .99 sure. <laughs> Whatever you say. My first question, Sonny, which object are you hiding closest to? Uh... That's a great question, Melon. I'm not sure if this is a book or a cookie. That's all I'm saying. Book or a cookie? I'm trying to find what you're talking about. Whoa. I think I found the book cookie, guys. <laughs> I think I found it. I hope not. Dude, this is my top secret hiding spot. Oh, guys, I'm not big enough to get to the book cookie. I guess if I'm not big enough, I'm gonna have to shrink down a little bit and figure out how Sunny got up there. Let's return to normal. Yo. Oh, guys, I'm back to normal. And the first thing I'm noticing is it seems like there's an elevator block right there. Jump! Can I go up another level? No, I can't. I've got to do some parkour. If I just become a little bit bigger, this jump should be no problemo. Hiya! Are you kidding me? One more time! Yes! I've made it up to the book cookie. It's time to shrink down. I see an opening in the book cookie. I can guarantee you Sonny's hiding in here. He must be. Sonny, for my second question, would you say you're hiding inside of the book cookie? Uh, yeah. I'm definitely inside of a book cookie. I just hope you're in the wrong one. Oh, it's over for you, Sonny. I'm on to you! No, 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 you didn't get me. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way! You idiot, Sonny. You're gonna have to get a little larger if you want to survive that fall. Okay. 
Dang it. Like this. Whatever, Melon. You win the first round of hide and seek. Now give me the size changing device and go find your hiding spot. Fine. Whoa, it's so huge. And now it's normal. Wait, I'm shrinking. I'm back to normal. Or really small, I guess. Now I'm the big boy. Good luck hiding. You got two minutes before I crush you. Yo, chill. Okay, guys, I've got to find my very own elevator. And I think I see one right under the bed. Come on, come on. There's even a little opening for me. It's so perfect. And now it's time for me to go up. Whoa, where am I? It looks like I'm on the bed. Yo, look at Sonny. I'm on his head level now. Well, it's time to get a little bit higher. And I see a ladder over there. Just how do I get up there is the question. Melon, 60 seconds left, bro. Time's ticking. Yo, chill. It's okay. I found the way. Just got to go on this ladder. Jump up. Yo, these ladders are so conveniently placed. This is awesome. And then make the ladder jump. Yeah. Oh, maybe there's a little nook I can hide in somewhere. <gasps> Wait a second. Is this another elevator? Yo, I'm going even higher. Dude, how many secrets are on this map? This is crazy, dude. Yo, can't get up there. Is there anywhere else? Wait a second. Wait a second. Yo, this secret's insane. I found some ghost blocks up here. <laughs> and I can even spy on Sunny through this one-way glass. There's no chance Sunny's finding me. Sunny, I'm ready. It's about time, Melon. Now, I've just got to make a couple of jobs and seek you you out. Let's see here. Is he on this cool bed? Like, what is this? This looks awesome. Yeah, that bed is pretty awesome, right? With the shark fins, the water. Wait, you're looking at me right now? Where are you? Where are you, you rotten melon? <laughs> That's for me to know and you to never find out. I feel like you're in this TV. Yeah. Guys, guys, he's looking suspiciously close to me. I don't like this. Uh, you could also be up here on this yellow curtain. Like, how else could you see me so easily? <gasps> Wait, you could be hiding with the toys up here on the computer desk. Come on, come on, make the jump. Melon, are you on this computer desk? That's my first question. Um, no. Why are you talking so weird? I'm not talking to anyone, Sonic. Okay, so he's not in this part of the room. Uh, I'm going back to the bed because you saw me over here. Dude, I'm convinced you're in this screen or whatever this is. Yeah, totally, Sonny. Totally. Why don't you waste a question on that? Fine. Are you inside of this obsidian computer screen? Uh, yeah. Oh, no! I knew it! I actually am a genius! Now, how do I get in there? Size-changing device? Make me tiny! It worked! Oh, no! It worked too well. I almost died. I've got one heart left. Okay, now I've got to find my way around Okay, I'm too small. I'm too small. I'm shorter than a block. <laughs> Sonny, you got two minutes left to find me. Good luck. That's fine. Size changer. Let's be slightly bigger than normal. That's perfect. Now, I should be able to find this watermelon pretty easily. Just gotta look for a secret passage or something. Size changer. Normal. This looks promising. Oh, melon. Interesting that I just found an elevator block. Uh... Guys, it's not good. He's kind of catching on to me, but there's no way he'll find my secret. Dude, how do you get into this? Is there an opening somewhere? Oh, there is. Melon, wait, what? There's nothing here? I just went inside of the wall and there's nothing. Yeah. Guys, this is not good. He's getting way too close. Okay, Melon, last question. How do you get inside of that TV? Is there like a secret ghost block or something? There might be a secret ghost block or something, Sonny. Dang it, bro. Ugh. Oh, guys, this is not good. He's getting way too close. Wait, there's a button. What does this do? There's another button. Bro, these buttons don't even do anything. You got one minute left, Sonny. I feel like there's a secret door here, but where? Gotta make the jump. Oh, that was that was not a jump you can make. <laughs> Sonny, you're such an idiot. Dang it. I'm at the bottom again. Okay, I can do this. Size changer. Let's get big. Yes. Now I can run fast. Gotta make up the time. Gotta make up the time. Oh, I'm running too fast for my own good. It's it's teleporting me. Oh, no. Uh, let's just be normal then. Normal. 30 seconds left, Sonny. That's plenty of time. I know exactly where you're hiding now. Come on. 
Come on. I've just got to take this elevator. Yes. And then get to the next one quick. Got to size up and make the jump. And then use the size changer to get small. Yes, it's worked. Now I'm back to this elevator. 15 seconds left. This is not good, guys. Huh? 10 seconds left. Nine, eight, seven. No! You're not getting away, Melon! Five! No! Yes! Sweet, sweet victory! The size changer is so powerful! Yes, Sonny, I know it's powerful! Now give me my size changer! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just smack you with it a little bit. Let me just slap him. Slap him. Stop, stop. Just give it to me. Give it to me. Give, give it to me. Give it to me! Fine, it's on the ground! And now, Sonny, it's time for you to hide! Why do I get the feeling you're gonna be bigger than I've ever seen? Whoa! Uh, run! Yeah, yeah. Who's getting bullied now? Who's getting bullied now? No, run, 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 run. I gotta hide. Don't look. Yes, guys, I made it. Melon has no clue about this. I placed a secret chest here before we started playing hide and seek today. And I've got an elytra with firework rockets. Check this out. I believe I can fly and cheat and hide in the skies. I just need to turn around and stick this landing before I flop on my face and die. That's how the song goes, guys. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. Yep. Pretty goaded hiding spot, I would say. And even if he does see me, I can just fly away again. Oh, no. Uh, I gotta get back in my hiding spot quick. Sonny, that's time, bro. And I may have done a little bit of cheating and saw which elevator you came up. No, bro, you're supposed to be blindfolded, you dirty cheat. <laughs> that's not my fault, dude. You started running before the time officially started. Whatever. You're gonna need every advantage you can get if you're gonna find me. It's time to go all the way up. What? Where the heck could you have gone from here? Everywhere, Melon. You'll never know where my top secret hiding spot is. I don't know how you did this without the size changing device, but I have it. So... All I've got to do is get a little bit bigger. Let me guess. You're going to jump across to the other platform where there's the little toys. Hold on. I got a little bit too big. I'm going to bump my head. This should do the trick. And jump! Yeah! And back to normal. Now, Sonny, for my first question, am I close to you right now? No, Melon. Not even a little bit. Wait. What the heck? You're not even close? Well, what's in this chest? 64 fireworks? What is going on? Guys, I just muted up. I can't believe I left fireworks. Or does that chest keep respawning more? I can't remember, bro. This is so weird. That's just really bad news. You could see Melon all the way over there. And if he has fireworks now, he might realize I got an elytra. You're nowhere in sight. And there's no way you could have even made it up here to begin with. What? Where could you have gone? I'm living in your melon rent free. There must be another elevator around here somewhere. Wait, what the heck? There's an elytra up here too? Wait, guys, what is melon doing? How did he just find an elytra? Oh no. You must have used an elytra to hide somewhere cheeky. I'm coming to find you, Sonny. Oh, uh, guys, I just saw melon take flight. He's right under me. He's right under me. Now, Sonny, which corner of the room would you say you're closest? to i would say just give me like 35 seconds to calculate it i'm just getting my geometry set out to make sure i get the right angle and carry the three dude answer hold on i'm doing the signs and the cosines and the tangents and uh i'm closest to the yellow cheese curtain the yellow cheese curtain that's not even a corner of the room yeah but it's because i'm not in a corner wait a second what is this structure what is what structure there's this structure on the top it's kind of more in the center of the room Room, and it's golden somewhere where a sunny would like to hide no uh he would hide on the giant cheese curtain because it's also golden yeah you sure about that sunny for my last question are you hiding on this weird mysterious gold object uh technically no i'm not <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I gotta go. Guys, I gotta go. Where are you, Sonny? Where did you go? Climb. Oh my, can I just, why can't I climb this? Sonny, where are you? Dead, very dead. You fell? Wait, I just gotta check spawn. Hey, Sonny, I found you. Dang it, bro. This is so hard to hide. When you have the size changer and an elytra, you're overpowered. Yeah, it's pretty broken. But Sonny, we're banning mm. elytra for this round. Fine. Just give me the size changer. Here you go, Sonny. And I'm out of here!
Yeah. Hey, Melon, look at me quick. What's up? This time, instead of being really big. Yeah. I'm going to be tiny. Can you even see me? No, you're like a little pixel. Yes. And this little pixel is going to follow you and find you. I mean, I won't cheat and follow you because I'd be cheating. I'm just going to find you. Uh, yo, you are way too small right now. Okay, guys, I've got to find an amazing hiding spot. Melon never said anything about ender pearls. Did you guys just see how far that thing went? What the heck? Where did I throw it? Okay, that is weird. Yo, guys, I found the final elevator. I wonder where this leads. Yeah. Yeah! Whoa! I can go all the way up! Yo, there's another elevator here! Dude, I'm going so high right now! Can I go up again? Ah. Dang it, I can't! Whoa, but this place is so awesome! Yo! Ladders! I'm climbing up this pot, I think. I think this is a teapot. Whoa, this isn't a too shabby of a place to hide. Oh, let go! Whoa! There's ghost blocks! Yo, I'm actually finding the best hiding spots in the game. What does that sound? Oh, that's very spooky. Anyways, I'm perfectly hidden. There's no chance Sonny's gonna find me. Especially not as the tiny boy he is. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. And I'm ready to find you, bruh. <laughs> And I can smell that melon rotting. Yo, I'm not rotting, Sonny. What are you talking about? When was the last time you fertilized that watermelon? Uh, last week? Yeah, you probably need to eat some extra compost, melon. And don't worry, when I find you, I'll make you eat some poo-poo! Yo, chill! Yeah, guys, I'm not so sure about this really tiny thing. I am so slow. I think bigger is better. Now, let's see. If I were melon, where would I hide? Look at Sonny on the bed over there. He has no idea where I'm hiding. So he hid in this screen last time. There's an elevator there that I've used. I get the feeling he's hiding in the other computer screen now. And look at that. An elevator block. Just gotta shrink down. Yep. That's good. Oh, Melon. I've got a question for you. What's up, Sonny? Did you use a bluish purple elevator block to get to your hiding spot? Uh, perhaps I did. Perhaps I didn't. You definitely did. And it can jump up two levels. Okay, second question. Out of those two elevator spots, which one did you use? The first floor or the second higher floor? The second higher floor. Is there a third floor? Because I see another one up there. Oh, there's another elevator block right here. That is so awesome. Yo, guys, he's way too close to me. I'm not a big fan of this. Let's see. Wait, Melon, last question. Did you use another bluish purple elevator block and go even higher up? I did. And you're out of question, Sonny. That's fine. That means I know where you are. You're up here somewhere. So it's only a matter of time until I track you down. What does that sound? That is creepy. And doop, doop, doop. Melon. You're here somewhere. I can just tell. Yeah, I am here somewhere. But this somewhere is somewhere you wouldn't find somewhere. Yeah? Why do I get the feeling these buttons activate a secret spot? I don't know. That's a really weird feeling to have. Plus, you only have one minute left. Dude, a minute is loads of time. Just gotta deduce your location and find you. Who? Ladder jump. Oh no, guys, he's climbing up the ladder. I really hope he doesn't find this block. I just want to scout out the rest of this area, press all the buttons. And yeah, I don't even think you can make these parkour jumps. Oh wait, I could go across the belly. Ow! Time to climb up again. Melon. 30 seconds left, Sonny. This game's in the bag. And then... The size machine will be mine. Melon, I know you jumped across this pig's belly. I could just tell. Make the jump! Yes! And then he probably went up here. No! Yes. 15 seconds left! Wait a second. How did I not notice these before? Oh, because there's blocks. Nine! Eight! Seven! Six! Six, five, four, three, two, one, go! Yeah, I won! I won! No, no, dude, I just punched you and there was two seconds left. No, 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 there was zero seconds left. I won this round, and that means I win the size machine. Wait a second, this was one-way glass and you were spying on me? Yeah, it was, Sonny. Now give it up, I win! Fine, I'm gonna give it up. One second, dude, one second. You'll never take it alive! No! It's mine. It's mine, guys. The precious, my precious. 
this. I'm huge. Oh no. Sonny, what have you done? Sonny, the power, it was too much. I'm dead. Actually, I'm back at the house. But it's okay because the size changer is all mine. And if you want size changing superpowers, make sure you like and subscribe. It'll help increase the size of our YouTube channel. Let's go. Today in Minecraft, we're building tiny houses, starting from a $1 house. Bro, this thing is trash. And going all the way up to a million dollar tiny mansion. Now this place is nice, except it's freaking tiny. Well, yeah, bro, that's the whole point. Oh, well, at least there's this tiny subscribe button. Press it now. Sonny, what have you done? What do you mean, what have I done? I'm just trying to enjoy some breakfast. What are you even eating, dude? There's nothing there. Oxygen. <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to eat oxygen too, Sonny, because check this out. All of our emeralds, they're gone. Wait, you're telling me we're broke? No way. Where'd our emeralds go? Oh, uh, Sonny, this is not good. Maybe we left them all at the bank? Come with me, quick. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what happened. We just deposited them in the bank so we could make some interest on our money. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Of course. That's, that must be what happened. A few minutes later. Sir, you are poor. You have zero emeralds. Dang it! Melon! Melon, we're broke! Are you kidding me? You're telling me all of our emeralds were gone? We had like at least one million. I know. We worked so hard for those emeralds and now we have nothing. Bro, I was finally gonna move out. <sighs> what are we gonna do? We have nothing to show for ourselves. And we're all out of fuel. We can't even drive home. Guess we'll go back on foot. Oh, this is the worst day ever. <laughs> Melon, we're so broke. <laughs> Who said that? What the? Hey, down here. Whoa, what the heck? What is that? Hello, sir. My name is Bob, and my house got destroyed when a chicken laid an egg on it. Uh, I'm sorry, Bob. That really sucks. I heard you are looking for some emeralds. I don't have much, but if you can build me a house, I will pay you an emerald. Melon, we've got to start somewhere. That's better than nothing. You're right, Sonny. And I'm sure Quandel has some kind of doohickey that lets us shrink down and can build him the most awesome house ever. Don't worry, Bob. We'll be back soon, and then we'll make you a brand new house. And we'll make sure it's chicken proof. Quandale, do you have any gadget that could shrink us down to, let's say, three pixels? Well, unfortunately, Melon, no. I have only a resizer that can make you two pixels tall. Uh, Quandale, that should do. What do you need this for, anyways? We need it so that we can build this tiny little dude a brand new house. His name's Bob, and he's about two pixels tall. So small that a chicken pooped an egg on his house and it broke. Oh, that's hilarious. If you're going to build a tiny house, you're going to need a chisel. Now get out of here. I have work to do. Ooh, thank you, Quandale. Appreciate all the tips. One resizer. Quandale, where's the chisel? It's right here, dude. Thank you, Quandale. We'll make Bob the most awesome tiny home ever. Are you ready, Sonny? Not yet. Now I'm ready. Yo, you might want to shrink back up because we got a lot of walking to do. Why don't you just carry me? Ah, <sighs> fine. Bob, we're back and we're here to make you the most awesome dirt house ever. Don't worry. Sorry, Bob. We're reconstructing it now. It's gonna be way better. Uh, Sonny, do you still have the resizer? Yeah, bro, but before you resize, you should grab some dirt pixels. Use that chisel over here on this big block. Oh, you're right. Hold on. Bada bing. Bada boom. Give me all of these! Yes. Yes. With, with this, Sonny, we can make the ultimate green top. Well, then make sure you grab some green ones, too. Oh, they're all green, Sonny. Don't worry. Oh, okay. They look like brown on my screen. Wait, I could just do it like this. Hey, give me all that. Sonny, I, I made a lot of pixels. Ooh, let me take some. Now I just gotta shrink down to two pixels. Don't stress, Bob. We're about to make you the best chicken-proof green top you've ever seen. Melon, start building! Let's do this. And voila. Bob, your one emerald house is complete. Wow, guys, this is so spacious. I love it. <laughs> Bob, I'm glad you like the house. And the best part is, it's egg-proof. So even if a chicken poops on there, you'll be good. Wow, you guys are the best. Here's that emerald I promised. <sighs> Thank you, Bob. Sonny, this is our first step onto greater things. We are now tiny house builders. Let's go. That's our first of millions. Now we just got to find some more people to build for. Yeah, but who's really going to want a tiny house? I feel like this is a pretty niche market. Wait a second, Melon. Do you feel that? What's happening? It's a wormhole. 
Whoa! Where are we, Melon? I don't know, but who are you? Hello, Sonny and Melon. I have seen your tiny building abilities, and I just know that you are the right people for this job. Wait, what? H how did you even know about that? That makes no sense. And how did we even get here? Oh, don't worry about that. I just need you for my little mushroom friend in this purple box. Fine, I won't question anything as long as you pay us well. I will give you 64 emeralds if you do it successfully. One whole stack of emeralds, Sonny? We're gonna be rich! Let's go! You were right! We're really moving up in the world! Now, Melon, all we have to do is open up this tiny box! And, oh, look at that mushroom guy! We gotta build him a house! Well, Sonny, first things first, we gotta shrink down. No way! I just got creative mode! Yo, me too! Yes, boys, I'm a magical wizard, so, of course, I granted you creative mode. Now, please make him a house. Thank you, wizard! All right, mushroom man, what are you thinking? What kind of style? of home do you want? Uh, Sonny, I have no idea what he's saying. I can translate this. He said, build with mushrooms only. Alright, well, we can do just that, mushroom man. Check this out, Melon. I'm gonna search mushrooms, grab one brown and one red, and then I'm also gonna search for bone meal. And one red mushroom! Voila! Perfect! I told you it would work, Melon! Wait, then we probably need a brown mushroom too to go along with this. And I need some more bone meal. Let me show you how it's done. I just gotta come over here, line it up, and poof! Whoa. Now, uh, Sonny, this isn't really much of a house. What should we do from here? We need to do some decorating, bro. If it's gonna be a mushroom top, it needs to have windows and a door and beds and everything that a normal house would have. All right, Sonny, you work on the red one. I'll work on the brown one. Yeah, we're gonna need some fences up here. This will be a nice mushroom balcony view. I hope the mushroom guy doesn't mind, but I've gotta remove the stem. We needed more space. Little shroom block right here. And Sonny, my uh, my build's complete. Uh, I got some more work to do. Torch, torch, torch. He's gonna need some windows so he can see. Oh, this is feeling more like a home already. Well, Sonny, we're gonna need a ladder so he can access his balcony. Yo, not a bad idea. I'm also setting up a crafting table and a furnace so that he can be nice and cozy in here. Yep, now if he wants to go upstairs, he just has to do a tiny little bit of parkour, make it up, and he's chilling. Yo, I think he's gonna love his new home. Oh, wait, Melon, one thing, one thing. Just in case it rains, he should have a roof. Oh, you're right. Well, let's see what he thinks. Hello, Mushroom Man, what do you think of your house? Uh, Sonny, can you translate what he said? Yeah, one second, he goes, uh... This is the best house ever. I love mushrooms. Well, that's awesome, Sonny. We did it. And it looks like we're getting summoned again. We're back. And Mr. Wizard, your little mushroom friend is super happy with his new home. That's wonderful. Thank you so much. I knew he would love it and that you wouldn't let me down. Here you go. One stack of emeralds. Uh, so where are these emeralds? Yeah, cough them up. Come down, boys. The emeralds are in the chest here. Oh, we're rich. Let's go! First we got one emerald, now we got a whole stack. All that's left now is to get a million! Boys, I've got something huge for you. Quandale, what is it, bro? I'll tell you in person when you get here. Hurry up! Okay, Quandale, we're on the way! Uh... Mr. Wizard, can you please teleport us back? Okay, no problem. Abracadabra, one million emeralds to you. Quandale, what is it? Okay, so I've been talking to this guy about a job that might interest you, seeing that you're in a pretty bad financial situation. Okay, Quandale, what kind of job are we talking about here? Well, guys, it's another tiny build project, and this guy wants you to build him a tiny mansion. Uh, isn't that, like, impossible, Quandale? Yeah, that kind of sounds like an oxymoron. Don't question it. Just step on the teleporter, and I'll send you there. Wait a second, Quandale. How much is he gonna pay us? One million emeralds. <gasps> Melon! Let's do this! All right. Beam us up, Quandy! Ah! Uh, Sonny, this is the client, the Mouse King. Oh, hi, you two. Quandale Dingleberry already told me a lot about you two. I need this mansion built as soon as possible. I'll pay you one million emeralds if you can make it in time. One million emeralds! We're gonna be filthy, stinking rich! Mouse King, we're gonna need, uh, like, creative mode or something if you want us to build you a mansion. That's no problem. I have that already arranged with Creative Ink. Just press this button over here. Whoa, Mouse King, you really are the king of rodents! That's awesome! Did it work, Melon? Are you a creative? 
I don't know. Am I sunny? <laughs> My turn. Boom. It worked. Let's go. Now, Sonny, I'm thinking because he's a rodent, we should probably build him an awesome melon house. It should have lots of red, lots of green. It should blend together nicely. Melon, that makes no sense whatsoever. He's a giant mouse. We should probably make him a yellow house that looks like a block of cheese. Bro, that makes absolutely no sense. You just want it to be yellow because you're Sonny. No, bro. I want it to be yellow because that's color of cheese. You want moldy cheese? If we make it green, that's gross. Yeah, well, he, he is a he is a mouse, Sonny. Like, maybe he likes moldy cheese. Let me ask him. Let me ask him. <clears throat> mouse King, do you like eating moldy cheese? You Mold? Disgusting. I only eat the finest cheese, as I am the most royal mouse after all. See, Melon, I told you. No one likes mold. Yep, yeah, but cheese is literally mold. I only eat pure cheddar. Yeah, you heard it, Melon. Only pure cheddar. Time to make a yellow house. Well, I'm not making a yellow house, Sonny. I refuse. Well, there's only one way to settle this. It's a tiny build bag. Battle. I'll construct the wall to divide us. And Melon, I'm gonna make the wall out of gold. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're so annoying, Sonny. The golden wall is complete, Melon. And it's time to face off in the ultimate tiny build. Let's do this thing! Okay, goats, it's time for me to work on my block of cheese house. Let's see here. I'm gonna need a lot of yellow, so let's go yellow wool. That looks nice. Ooh, look at all these different types of concretes. Oh, so many choices. I'll start with just generic. And what else would be good? Sponges might be interesting. Those kind of look cheesy too. I already know. The Mouse King wants to dine on something other than cheese. Like a watermelon, perhaps. But it's not a real watermelon, so it's okay. Plus, he's not even eating this. It's just a house. It's time to construct the base. Yep, that looks pretty good. Anyways, let's start building. I need to get the framework in place. He wants a mansion, which means it needs to be pretty big. Yeah, this is a good size right here. And how many stories do I want this to be? Definitely a couple. Level two, I'm gonna do more yellow concrete like this. Excellent, two floors complete. Now I need to fill these in a little bit. Let's see here, let's see. I'm gonna make the room dividers out of sponges because this will look extra cheesy. All right, boys, the base of the watermelon has been constructed. Now I just need to start making some watermelon lines. Give me some green terracotta and let's start building this up. There we go, the wander Watermelon lines have been completed. Now let's add my triple doorway. Yep, not even just a double doorway, a triple doorway. There we go. Some warped doors. That doesn't look very great. I'm not even gonna kyop. Instead, we'll use some secret doors to enter my mansion. Now, goats, I can't show you the inside of this watermelon, but trust me, it is the most awesome mega mansion you've ever seen. You guys will see it when the Mouse King himself sees it. Trust me, goats, it is pure awesome. Awesomeness. Yes, simply exquisite, my build. It's perfect. Check it out. It's all yellow and cheesy. The only thing left to do now is put a couple of decorations on the rooftop. Let's see, what do I want on the rooftop? I already got a swimming pool down there for the king mouse. I think I need some umbrellas or something to suntan. Let's see, yellow carpets, that's nice. Ooh, some yellow valves will look like a nice decoration. Toolbox, which kind of low-key looks like a radio. Trampoline, of course I need that. And anything else cool here? Nah, who cares? Let's get a trampoline installed over here like this. Oh, this is perfect. This is so perfect. Okay, goats, now that I'm done my build, it's time to sabotage a little bit. Oh, look at this house. It's so cool, Sonny. <laughs> but check this out. Sphere dynamite! Melon, what are you doing? Bro, what the heck? I'm in the middle of building here! Sorry, sorry, that was the wrong dynamite. I meant to do, uh, I meant to do this one. Sorry, buddy. M Melon, Melon, stop it! Don't you want to get a million emeralds? Yeah, but that's gonna be with my awesome Wandermelon house. Bro, this makes no sense. The King Mouse literally said he likes cheese. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. Hold on, hold on. Let me at least finish it and show it to him first, please. Please. I need, uh, decorations here. Oh, yeah, decoration by the pool. And, yeah, yeah, swim in the pool and listen to the radio. Nice. Well, let's see what the lucky dynamite thinks. Nope, Melon. Melon! 
Hey, it wasn't too bad, Sonny. That's it. Let me see what another dynamite thinks of your house, huh? What about this one? No, 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 that's not cool. That's not cool. That's a watermelon. Don't. What are you doing? Fireworks. Oh, no, I hit my house, too. What have you done to my watermelon? I pulverized it. And wait, bro, this isn't even a house. There's nothing in here. No, 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 you're supposed to use your imagination. It's supposed to be the greatest thing you could ever see. You just gotta imagine. Think hard. There's a water park in here. Oh, water park? You want a water park? Sonny, don't do it. Don't do it! Have a water park on the house! Oh, no, Sonny. It's supposed to be your imagination, not literal. <laughs> That's what you get, bro. You're ruining everything. We were gonna get rich, and now all we have is a bunch of ruins. Although my cheese is still pretty good. You revealed my deepest and darkest secrets, Sonny. I cannot allow your house to live! Melon? Melon? No, 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 no. Get rid of the TNT. I can get rid of the TNT. I can do this. I can do this in time. No! 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 Yeah, you ruin my creation. I ruin yours. No, Melon, you literally started this. And now I have nothing left. I have no cheese. Ah! No! My creative mode! Uh, what's up, Mouse King? You've used my creative mode for absolutely nothing. Why are you guys trolling each other? Well, I was trying to make you the most awesome house ever. And I literally built you a giant cheese house. Well, tiny, technically, but it was a mansion of cheese. What is wrong with you two? You wasted my creative ink money. You now owe me 65 emeralds to pay for it. But Mouse King, we only have 65 emeralds. Oh no, Melon. Not like this. Not like this. Dang it. We just lost our emeralds. Now get out of here. Fine. Uh, Melon, what the heck? We just walked through that portal, but now we're back in our house? Yeah, wait. What's going on? Um, it looks like the Mouse King's palace was in our home the entire time. Wait a second. He was in our walls? No, don't tell me, Melon. I'm following the trail. Where does this lead? Come to think of it, how did a mouse get so many emeralds? No, Melon, he didn't. He stole ours! This trail leads straight to our emerald barrel! Are you serious? Are you kidding me? Even if we did that correctly, we would have just gotten back all the emeralds that we worked for originally! He stole from us and then tried to make us do work! And then he took our hard-earned emeralds away from us once again! Bruh! He's got to pay for this! Goats, press that like button, subscribe, and comment down below how we should get our revenge on the Mouse King. Do it now! Today in Minecraft, I shrunk myself down to the size of one pixel and then lived inside of Melon's house without him even knowing it. I put this keypad door and laser fence, but someone still keeps stealing all my food and diamonds. Melon has no idea that I'm living in his diamond chest. Goats! Please tell me who's sneaking into my house. I swear if it's sunny. Oh, what the heck, guys? I can't sleep. What time is it? Bro, it's the middle of the night, man. Oh, maybe, maybe I can get to sleep. What the, what the heck? Oh, oh, it's absolutely disgusting. That's it, guys. I can't do this anymore. I've had enough of Sonny's snoring and his night farts. They're disgusting. Oh, I'm bringing my bed to the basement. Oh, I have to do this every single night. It's so annoying. At last, I can sleep. Good morning, Minecraft. Hey, Melon. Melon, where are you, bro? Did you sleep in the basement again tonight? Yes, I did, Sonny. You were farting all night. <laughs> I thought you appreciated that, bro. Isn't it like extra fertilizer? No, it's disgusting, Sonny. We've been over this. That's not even true. Melons don't eat poop. Sorry, bro. I thought I was helping you photosynthesize. Anyways, bro, it is a beautiful day in Minecraft to sit back, relax, and eat all the food in the house. Let's go. Oh, Sonny, I'm done with you, bro. Ah, uh, yes. The last cookie. Don't you eat it. Don't you eat it. That's it, Sonny. I'm done with you. Wait, Melon, what do you mean you're done with me? It means I need a break, Sonny. This is just too much. I, I, I can't deal with you. All right, why don't you just clear your head and go for a walk? Guys, I'm not just going on a walk. I'm going on a full-on vacation! Alone, without Sunny. Guys, check it out. My beautiful vacation home. Ah, uh, isn't it just wonderful? Why are there cobwebs here? Well, I guess I am kind of broke. I'm only paying $2 a night. So, you get what you pay for. Man, I'm so hungry, though. Ooh! 
Ooh, we got a cake. That's awesome, bro. I can't wait to eat this later. Oh, uh, give me some of that. Oh, that was delicious. Mm. I wonder what's around here. Maybe there's some cool animals. Yo, check it out. There's a bee. Oh, he doesn't like me. He went in his hive. Gotta be something to do around here. The heck? What is this? What did I just find? This is insane, bro. It's got laser beams. I should probably call Sonny. Hi, hello? Yo, Sonny, you're not gonna believe it. I found some kind of secret laboratory. Get to my coordinates immediately. Yo, Melon, relax, bro. Is this a prank call? No, it's not. I'm serious. You were so mad at me just yesterday. Yeah, it's fine, bro. We got more important matters at hand. Okay, fine. Just send me the coordinates. I'll head over right away. Okay, it's 28967612233. I'm on the way. Melon's location should be just a couple hundred blocks this way. Wait, why is Melon calling? again. Yes, Melon, what is it? Uh, yeah, don't forget to bring pickaxes. We're probably gonna need them. Bro, why did you say that before? Okay, I'm going back to the house. Should have a pickaxe right here. There we go. And I'm gonna bring some food for the journey. One eternity later. Melon! Oh, that took forever. What is it? What did you find? I, I don't know, Sonny. It's some kind of secret laboratory. Could belong to Dr. Longbottoms. Yeah, it looks suspicious, bro. With laser beam security like this, we've got to be careful disabling it. Yeah, you're absolute. Whoa. Sonny, do you see that, bro? There's levers. Okay, let me just deactivate all these. Yo, you disabled one of the lasers. Nice. Let me get the other two. And the last one. One. You did it, Sonny. Oh, you got some blocks, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Here you go. What is this? I don't know, bro, but I'm not so sure we're meant to be here. This looks like the city's plumbing system or something. Bro, this ain't the city's plumbing system. We gotta break on in. Yeah, I guess we did come this far. We might as well finish the investigation. Sonny, do you see what I see? A trap door. This must lead into the lab! Yo, what is this? It looks like we're in the ventilation ducts. We've got to investigate. It, Sonny. There's got to be something here. There's no way there'd be a lab in the middle of nowhere. Yo, Sonny? Yes? What did we find? This looks like one of Longbottom's abandoned laboratories. Does, bro. There's got to be something around here that we can use. What is this stuff? I don't know, but Sonny, be careful. It's very dangerous. I'm gonna go investigate other areas of the lab. You have fun with that. I'll take a look through all these barrels and chests. Whoa! The Pixelizer 3 thousand. Let me just tuck that away for later. Yeah, Melon, nothing useful in there. Nothing at all. Good, Sonny, because remember, any kind of mischievous doohickeys we find, we've got to report to Quandale. They could be dangerous and potentially lead to the end of all of Minecraft. Yeah, don't worry, bro. These chests contained nothing of value. Nothing interesting at all. Good, good. Yeah, it is kind of weird. They're all empty. Yep. All empty. All empty. Well, Sonny, we might as well dip. Yep, I agree. Let's get out of here. So, now what? Um, I guess, I guess we just go back doing whatever we were doing. Yeah, are you coming home yet, bro? It's kind of getting boring without you. Uh, nope. I've just gotta do, you know, I gotta milk a cow. Dude, there's cows everywhere in this field, and we have a barn house at our place. Uh... Guys, I don't know what's up with Melon. He's acting really sus. So, I'm gonna pretend I'm leaving, but I'm gonna follow him back to wherever he's going. Okay, guys. I think I lost Sonny. I gotta head to my vacation house. It's so beautiful and awesome without him. He went just over this hill. There he is. I followed Melon all the way here. But what exactly is this place? Ah, oh, my beautiful vacation home. Isn't it just gorgeous? I'll even have another slice of cake. Oh, so delicious. Guys, I need to take a closer look. I have a feeling Melon has a brand new vacation home and he didn't even invite me. How could he? Oh. It's so nice to just chill once in a while and not have to worry about a thing. He thinks he's so cool with his vacation house. That's it. I'm going to hit him with the Pixelizer 3000. Wait, no. What's happening? Ah, what happened? I'm so tiny. Do, 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 do. Yo, guys, Melon's huge. This is bad. This is bad. Ah, what a beautiful day. Guys, I'm so tiny. This Pixelizer 3000, it shrunk 
me. That's it. I've got to return myself to normal size and head back home. Then I can prank Melon. Yes, everything I need is in the ender chest. I'm just going to snag this elytra and firework rocket. I have another ender chest to grab my stash once I'm inside of Melon's house. And now it's time to fly. Check it out. I made it to his house and shrunk myself down so tiny. Now I just need to fly inside. Yes. I hope he doesn't notice. Oh, gotta dodge. There's gotta be a spot here to hide. Yo, in the wither skull. That looks perfect. Ow, ow, ow. I've just gotta dig inside. Check it out. The perfect view. Now let's check out what Melon gets up to on a normal day at his vacation house. Guys, finally, now that I'm all alone, I can practice my singing. I want to swing from the what am I listening to? My ears. No, 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 no. I need something. I need something now. Oh, come on. That's it. I'm clogging my ears. I'm clogging my ears with the roses. Come on. <laughs> Okay, okay, I absolutely hit that high C there. I'm pretty proud of myself. That was horrendous, guys. I never want to hear him sing again. Well, time to check on my melon plant. Hope the rind is looking ripe and beautiful. Check it out. This will be a full-grown melon in a matter of months. Yo, guys, he's got a melon stem growing inside of his house. It'd be a real shame if something were to happen to it. Time to water this boy. There's a beautiful pond outside in my vacation home. Guys, this is the perfect chance. I'm gonna break out of here and get up to no good. Just gotta fly! Yes! His precious watermelon stem. It's time for me to corrupt this. By planting some wither roses. <laughs> yes! This is gonna turn it into the ultimate jack-o'-lantern! Yes! It worked! <laughs> Look at that! It's now a pumpkin stem! Guys, he's gonna be so confused! Oh, my little baby wants some water. What what happened to my baby? Why is it a pumpkin? No, oh, this can't be. This can't be. These wither roses? What happened? What kind of plague took him over? <laughs> I knew it, guys! It worked! Look how salty Melon is! Oh, that was a good first prank. That was so perfect. Oh, I can't wait to get up to more mischievous business. Rest in peace, sweet baby Melon. It's time to bury you, sweet wampum. This is my perfect opportunity to strike. While Melon's saying goodbye to his little watermelon, it's time for me to eat his cake. Come on, let me up. Oh, wait, that is a lot of cake. I'm not really so sure I can eat that. Bro. It looks delicious, but it's way too big. But maybe, maybe I can shrink it down so small that Melon can't even enjoy it. Yeah, let's try it. It worked. Yo, it's so puny now. And I'm even going to eat a slice. Nom. <laughs> That's perfect. Time for me to go hide and catch his reaction. I can barely even see the cake from up here. <laughs> he was gone too soon. Oh, I'm so hungry though. I've got to drown my sorrows by eating my cake. What happened to my cake? It's so tiny. Yes. <laughs> Another successful prank. Bro, it's so easy to troll Melon. Oh, this doesn't get old. Bro, what am I gonna eat? Guess I'll grab something from the fridge. Wait, guys, he's gonna get some food from the fridge. Uh, I've gotta be fast. Come on, come on, come on. There's gotta be a way in somewhere. Mm, what to eat, what to eat. Got a burger, cake, stew, water, baked potato. Oh, this might take me a while. Mm. Yo, guys, I'm breaking into the fridge. I've got to be fast here. Yes, I'm in his refrigerator. Let's see. What do I want to mess with? Ooh, looks like he's got some carrot rabbit stew. It'd be a real shame if something were to happen to it. And double the poison, double the fun. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. What else is here? Yo, he's got even more cake. What the heck? That's it. Poison that as well. And what's on the top shelf? Ew. This place is gross. It's stinky old cheese. Poison it. Kill it. Kill it. Mmm. 
hamburger sounds pretty good right now. Mmm, it's even got extra cheese on it. No way! He just took the cheeseburger with the extra stanky cheese! Oh, I'm glad I poisoned that as well. This looks absolutely delicious. I can't wait to chow down! Oh, so good! Oh, no! Guys, I hear Melon screaming. I've gotta see it! It worked! He's poisoned! <laughs> Oh, this is what he gets for having his secret vacation home. Oh, it all feels so good. Oh. Ew, gross. He just puked. Oh, I need a second outside. Okay, guys, while Melon's outside, I'm going to rig his oven to explode. Let's go grab that TNT, shall we? This is the perfect prank. Because after all that food poisoning and his cake shrinking, he's still going to need a bite to eat sooner or later. <laughs> And when he does, it's gonna go kaboom! Now I've just gotta set it up right in here. Yes, I'm inside of his oven. Now it's time to let this cook. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Yo, goats, check this out. I have a perfect tunnel all the way down into his furnace to ignite the TNT. So when he goes to cook some food, I simply light this up and run for it. Now it's only a matter of time until he gets hungry. Hungry. The next day. Oh, I'm finally done puking. And I feel a lot better now. I'm just starving. I need to eat something. Oh, man, am I hungry. Guys, I think Melon's coming inside to get a bite to eat. Oh, I could use some eggs right now. Yo, guys, it looks like he's about to fry some eggs. <laughs> Let's get some scrambled melon. <gasps> Gotta go. Just fry. What is this? <laughs> It actually killed him, and I've destroyed half of his vacation house. I'm out of here. No, my beautiful vacation house. The owners on Airbnb are going to charge me a fortune. That's what you get, Melon. What, Sonny? What the heck? What are you doing here? I came to get my revenge. You thought it was cool to just have a vacation without me? Bro, I'm allowed. What, what do you mean? No, not on my watch. <laughs> so I can't have some peace and quiet? You thought you just had to ruin it by exploding my vacation house? What do you mean ruin it? You're the one who invited me to help you explore that laboratory, and I found the Pixelizer 3000. That's how you're so small right now. Son of you scumbag! Drown! Drown! No, Melon, Melon, not cool! Not cool! Today in Minecraft, I shrunk down to the size of one pixel in order to prank my friend Melon. I swear I just saw a little yellow bug that looked suspiciously like Sunny. <laughs> Subscribe right now to make Melon mad. Dang it! Who unplugged my computer? Yes! Finally, Melon! We found a desert pyramid! Bro, I dibs diamonds. I dibs diamonds. Fine, you can have the diamonds. I dibs the rest of the loot. If there's any notch apples, they belong to me. Dang it! I should have called that too. Yeah, you can't just take all the loot. Wait, wait, wait. Be careful. Be careful. We got to do this really intelligently, okay? Okay, I'm going in. No, Mallet. Don't do that. Ow, you do damage. Chill. I know. I got to dig down the sides and disable the pressure plate. I don't want us to mess this up. And hold on. Okay, it's safe. TNT. I call the TNT. Let's loot. Oh, gunpowder. I'll take that. Oh, saddle. Yeah, here we go. Iron. Come on, diamonds. Golden apple. Golden apple. Oh. Dang it! Wait, what is that? What are you holding, Sonny? I got the gold, the emeralds. What do you mean, what am I holding? Bro, what is that sword? Giant sword! Yo! Crazy. This is crazy. All right, I gotta get out of here. I gotta see how big this is. Bro, wait, 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 wait for me. Wait for Fine, you know what? I'll water bucket out. Yeah, water bucket out. <laughs> no, no! Chill. I'm good. I'm in water. I'm chilling. Yeah, I regret everything. Oh, yeah, we're fine. Sonny, you're so annoying. Dude, I was just getting building blocks. Look how many I have now. Hey, fine. Dude, don't make me do it. You know what? I'm doing it. <laughs> you can't hit me, buddy. Yeah. Ow! How did you hit me? Ow! Yeah, it's a giant sword. Bro, that sword is OP! Chill! Chill, chill, Sonny. I'm on two hearts. Two hearts. Chill, chill. Yeah, then let me up first. Now, let's see just how big this sword it is. Yo, it's huge. I can't even see the whole thing. Dude, that thing is massive. Can you hit me from there, Sonny? Eh, uh, no, but from here. Ow, ow, chill, 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 relax, relax. Don't make me. No, calm 
Calm down! Calm down! I'm very calm. And uh, don't shoot me again. You actually almost killed me. <laughs> oh, it would be a shame if I killed you and took that awesome giant sword that's super awesome. Yeah, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Ow, 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 ow! Die! Well, Melon, that adventure was awesome. Now I gotta go put my sword away. Wanna know where Sonny's putting... Oh, oh, oh. Hey, Sonny. What's up? Hey, how are you? I'm just trying to find the front door. I forgot where it is. Bro, it's this way, silly. It's this way. I know, I know. Guys, should I put my giant sword in the mailbox? No, that's too obvious. Melon will find it for sure. And I'll bait him out with some gunpowder. I wonder if he put his giant sword in here. Dang it, just gunpowder. But I'll take it. Guys, I'm gonna put it up here. Time to set the passcode. Let's go with one, two, three, five. He'll never suspect it. And put my giant sword and golden apples safely away. Hey, Melon, what show are you watching? Uh, I'm watching the channel about the void. It's about the void in Minecraft. Yeah, this looks really boring, bro. There's nothing on the TV. Yeah, that's what the void is, Sonny. It's it's just the void. Dude, this guy is so deep in the void. Isn't that awesome, though? Wow, really cool, really cool. I, I'm going in the kitchen, bro. I'm done with you. I'm gonna make some food. I know he put his sword somewhere up here. He probably put it in his chest. Okay, just gotta crack his password. One, two, three, four, five. No, one, two, five, six, nine, six, nine, six, nine. Six, nine. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. What the heck could it be? Uh, uh, one, two, three, five. Yo, it worked. Giant sword. This is awesome. And now it's time to store it in my very own chest, okay? Put it in my coat <laughs> that Sonny will never be able to guess. And boom, the perfect crime. Guys, I'm hearing some noise upstairs. What's going on, Melon? I'm just watching the void. Were you just upstairs? No, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just watching the void. It's really cool. Like this guy's at 10,000 blocks now. Yeah, really cool. Really cool void. No, no, Sonny, stop! Okay, Melon, question for you. Do you want to go on another adventure? so you can get your own giant sword. Maybe we'll find a giant diamond sword. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay, I'm gonna go get my weapon and then we'll roll out. Wait, 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 Sunny, Sunny, Sunny. You don't need to grab your weapon. We don't want to risk losing it, right? I mean, if I have it, there's no way I can lose it. I'll be too strong and powerful. Are you sure? Are you sure? Where did it go? Melon, did you take my giant sword? Uh... Okay, guys, I don't totally believe Melon, <laughs> so I'm gonna go to the fridge and grab what every good refrigerator holds, the code breaker. And let's go see if he's telling the truth. Hey, Melon, you don't mind if I take a look at your chest, do you? Uh-huh, you can't get in my chest, Sonny. You don't know my passcode. Yeah, 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 I don't need to know your passcode. Open up! Open up! I mind! I mind! Guys, Melon stole my sword. He took it and lied to me! It's fine. I'll pretend I never noticed. Yeah, everything seems to be in order. Melon. Nothing unusual upstairs. Our chests look perfectly fine. Wait, really? Perfect. Awesome. <laughs> sweet, 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 sweet. So let's uh, let's go on this adventure, right? Let's go. Yeah, just give me a sec. I gotta go do something quick. Uh, you get a head start and tame the horses for us, okay? All right, I got you. You shall be my steed and I shall call you Horse Muscle. Okay, here we are at Quandale Dingleberry's shop and let's see what type of loot he has today. Yeah, what up? Dr. Quandale. Wandale. My guy's been studying. Congratulations on your new title. You seem so much more official. And oh, he doesn't want to talk. Okay. So, Quandale, now that you're a doctor, do you have any cool items for sale? Wait, you have a shrinking potion? That's perfect. I could use that to prank Melon. How much is it going to cost me? You want diamonds? Netherite? You want my giant sword? How'd you even hear about that? Oh, it was your desert pyramid. Oh, sorry about that, Quando. Yeah, seems like a fair trade. I took it out of the chest anyways, but Melon wasn't looking. Here you go. And now where's that little shrinking potion? Oh, there it is. Tiny shrinking potion. Just gotta splash this on myself. Boop. Yo! I'm so tiny! Oh, this is gonna take forever to get anywhere, isn't it? I am so slow. Oh, what the heck? My horse just pooped on me. I'm gonna go take a shower. Oh, sorry, horse. Yo, guys, I heard Melon just talking about needing to shower. So I got myself way up in the bathroom, and just before he activates the shower, I'll swap the water out to TNT. Oh, this is actually disgusting. It's not fertilizer poop. It's the gross kind that hurts 
hurts you and is disgusting and gross. Come to think of it, most poop is actually gross when it's on you. Okay, take a shower and forget this ever happened. Oh, guys, there he is. He's about to turn the shower on. Just gotta swap this out. Perfect. Now all I need is a nice, relaxing shower. What the heck? No, it worked. It actually worked. Oh, I just barely survived. What was that? My bathroom is ruined. Dude, I gotta fix up this house. This is so annoying. Yo, Melon has no idea that I'm spying on him right now. Oh, I'm getting pretty hungry rebuilding this bathroom. Can't wait to get some food after I'm done. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be awesome. Doesn't look too shabby. Guys, Melon just said he wants to get some food soon. I gotta go set up the fridge with some pranks. Gotta make a run for it. This go here? No, I don't think so. Where did this thing go? I'm going as fast as... I can. Kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. Here it is. And then I gotta make my way into the fridge. Yes, I made it into the fridge. And I've got all these items to troll melon. Oh, is this some rabbit stew? Time to make it curse. Yes, this is gonna be the weirdest rabbit stew ever. And let's see what's on the next shelf of the fridge. What do we have here? Oh, this looks like a giant cake. It'd be a real shame if these were to be replaced with lava. Oh, yes. Oh, Melon, when you eat this cake, you're in for it. It's gonna be hot. Oh, and what's this over here? Oh, a little cup of water. Oh, if he gets thirsty. Poor guy. I'm turning it into fake water. It's gonna poison him. Yes. And I wonder what's up here on the third shelf. Oh, a wander melon and a baked potato. Well, time to make this into a poisonous potato. Boom, boom. That worked beautifully. Now when melon takes a bite out of this, it's gonna make him so nauseous. And what to do with this precious watermelon? I think I know just the thing. Thing. I'm gonna fill it with TNT! Yes! When he goes to check up on it, it'll explode! Oh, this is where it goes. And I'm done. Man, I am starving. Time to go eat. Do, do, do. What is in the kitchen fridge? Guys, I hear Melon coming. I gotta go. I gotta go! Get me out of here. Get me out of here! Give me food. Give me food. What's in the fridge? Guys, I got out of the fridge just in time. Melon's here. I don't even care. Poisonous potato? I don't care. I'll eat it. Oh, I'm starving. Ow! 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 Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it's gone. It's gone. It's okay. It satisfied my hunger a little bit. Melon? No way I'm eating a melon. There's no chance. Oh, uh, I'll eat some cake. That sounds good. And I'll have some water to wash this down. Where do I want to eat this delicacy? I think right here should do the trick. And boom! Guys, he's about to eat the cake. This is gonna be hilarious. Ooh, I can't wait to try this cake. Give me a slice! Oh, delicious. What's happening? Why? Why? What? <laughs> <laughs> it actually worked. Melon just cooked himself in lava. Ever seen that before? A hot lava cake. I guess that's kind of normal. That's like a chocolate fondue cake. Yeah, I guess. But not like this. Not like this one. What was that? Oh, oh, I gotta put this out now. I gotta put this out now. Oh, oh, oh. Go, go away, lava. Go away. Go away. Don't destroy my beautiful kitchen. Oh, oh. Never again am I eating cake. What the heck? Well, at the very least, I can enjoy this water. What the heck? What is happening? Why am I poisoned? Why? Why? Oh, oh. Okay, there's gotta be something I can do. Think about it calmly. Think about it calmly. Okay, if I get some milk from a cow, I can survive. Please, please. Wait, poison doesn't kill you. I'm actually good. I'm good. Dude, why is everything in that fridge so cursed? That's it. I'm getting something from the other fridge. Maybe this just wasn't turned on or something, but this one definitely is. Ooh, rabbit stew. Sounds delicious. And I need this to heal. Guys, Melon's about to eat the rabbit stew. I don't even know what's gonna happen with this one. I made it so cursed. Time to feast. Nom, 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 nom. Ow! What was that? Big Man Melon was slain by the killer bunny. What the heck? What do you mean, killer bunny? What do you mean, killer bunnies? That doesn't even make sense. Oh my god! There's so many! Wait, 
Why am I even getting hit? Okay, I gotta take these rabbits out. You are pests. You're all ow. Final rabbit. Yes. Well, I know what I'm eating tonight. Fresh rabbit. No way I'm eating anything out of these fridges. Time to go and grill. Yo, goats, check it out. Mellet's coming outside to use his barbecue grill. And I'm just hiding in the grass. So puny. One pixel tall. He has no clue what's about to happen. This grill is awesome. And now I'm just gonna light a few of Mellon's cows on fire. Burn! 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 Oh! And then I'm activating lightning TNT. I'm out of here. Ah! Wait, what's happening? No, not my cows. No, what happened? Ow, ow, ow. What happened to all my cows? What the heck? They've all been electrocuted. And now while Mel is distracted, I'm gonna pay his grill a little visit. Oh, he's trying to make some cooked rabbit, is he? Well, he's got another thing coming. Take my big sword. You think you could just get away with that? Think again. TNT, TNT. And goodbye. Run away. What's happening? What's happening? What the heck? Why are there more explosions? No. Not my grill. Oh, are you? Are you kidding me? That was my pride and joy. That was my baby. How am I gonna eat? I'm starving. Drive by. And now, guys, I'm gonna just nod his ankles a little bit. Like, <laughs> ow, ow, what the heck was that? Wait, something came in the mail. What's this? A book and quill. Is this for me? Dear Melon, I think you are the most handsomest, smartest, funniest, handsomest melon ever. Oh, I thank you. Would you like to go on a date with me? Wait, who's this from? From Melanie. Wait, Melody's asking me on a date? Dude, I gotta get ready. I gotta get ready. Yo, what the heck, guys? Melon just got an invitation for dinner with Melanie, his one true love. He's got such a crush on that watermelon. I gotta get to that place first and prank it. I gotta be quick. I gotta be quick. Okay, guys, I made it to the diner in time. And if you see on the roof, there's a little block of TNT. And everything underneath that is made of ghost blocks. So if I take this little flame bow and I shoot the TNT, it should fall through the roof and blow up Melanie, ruining Melon's date and killing his crush. I know it's a little evil, but you gotta do what you gotta do. It's my villain arc. <laughs> Guys, the sun's about to set. It's so beautiful out here, so romantic. Melon should be here any second for his date. And I've arrived. Where is Melanie? I bet you she's looking gorgeous today. Yo, guys, Melon just went in the restaurant. Oh, Melanie, you're looking good listening today. You're so beautiful. Have I ever told you that? Guys, this is so cringe. I can hear him from all the way over here. Hey, I got a joke for you, Melanie. What, what do you call the difference between the inside of a watermelon and the outside of the watermelon? Uh, one's inside the rind. <laughs> I gotta ruin this date right now. That was too cringe. And please hit! Oh, uh, I was a little bit off. Here we go. Oh, a little bit off. I, I might just burn down the restaurant instead, huh? Oh, there we go. Melanie, I just get lost in your... Wait, what happened to your face? What? I survived, but Melanie was exploded. No. All I have left is her beautiful face. Guys, that worked out perfectly. Look at the restaurant. The whole thing's exploded. Why are there ghost blocks? And what caused that? Somebody is pranking me and I don't like it. <laughs> oh, she's gone. I miss her so much. Yo, guys, look at Melanie. He's just crying and eating ice cream. He's such a baby. Oh, this prank was perfect. <laughs> Come to think of it, I haven't seen Sonny in a while. Yo, guys, look at this trash TV show he's watching. This looks so boring. Oh, oh, my potion. No, it wore off. Sonny, what happened? You just grew into existence. Uh, I was just, uh, I was over in the kitchen and I was gonna ask you if you wanted something to eat. You've been pranking me this Oh, die! Die! You killed Melody! You killed Melody! I can make it up to you! I have diamond ores! I have diamond ores! Okay, but I don't even have a pickaxe to mine that. It's fine. There's a pickaxe up in my password protected chest, and it's really cool and giant. It's totally worth it, and I'm so sorry about Melody. You go first. You go first. Okay, I'm, I'm upstairs. Chill. And now, I will unlock your chest. Yeah, and then you wonder why I was pranking you. Oh, you do have a giant's pickaxe. This is pretty nice, Sonny. I told you it was good. Now just chill out for a second, okay? I'll put the diamond ores down. They're all for you. Diamonds? No! 
Sonny! You thought, you thought I would just give you diamonds after that? You stole my giant sword, lied about it, and then you hacked my chest again and took my big pickaxe. This is what you get. You're a dead man, Sonny. You're a dead man. Am I? Am I really? What if I, what if I, oh, I am dead. Now, guys, make sure you like and subscribe if you feel bad for me. This is Minecraft, but every time we gain XP, we get bigger. Sonny, how are you so massive? I'm gonna squash you, Melon. Help, quickly, subscribe and comment Melon emojis to save me. We're so tiny. Yo, we're so small. I don't want to be small forever, Sonny. What are we gonna do? Why does this keep happening? Yo, check out the cornflower. It's taller than us. Yo, what the heck? Yo, even the item is taller than us. But at least we're stronger than it. We can beat it up. Yo, we can still hold it, though. Wait, what is Gord doing here? Gord? What did you do? Are you responsible for us getting so small? Yo, we just nodded his head. Bruh. Are you serious? We have 15 minutes to collect XP to get bigger? Yo, what? At the end of the 15 minutes, we have to duel it out to see who's the goat? Yo, Sonny. Bro, I am gonna destroy you in this 1v1. We'll see about that, bro. I'm gonna show the viewers that I am the goat. Let's do this. Stay away from me, bro. You stink like cow poop. Wait a second, Melon. Gord says the timer starts, right? Hold on. Let me get a head start. Let me find a tree. Yo, chill. The timer starts now. 15 minutes. Yo, you take fall damage from one block. This is insane, bro. I need to find my way to a tree quickly. I'm getting to a tree. I'm almost at the forest. Please. I really hope these bees don't attack me, bro. If they sting me, I'm so small. It's gonna kill me for sure. Yo, give me this wood. Yes. Oh, I'm gathering wood already, Sonny. It's over for you. Yeah, I'm gathering wood now too. First log broken. Can I pick it up? Bro, you gotta go so close to these things. And then can I reach? Yes, I could just barely reach the next log. Yo, no way. I tried to hit three logs up and I couldn't even reach it. I need to make a crafting table and I need one more log for a pickaxe. I already have a pickaxe, Sonny. I'm ahead of you, bro. And I'm making myself a shovel. Yo, chill. Ow. That fall damage hits different. And I need this. Shovel. Yo, I'm getting XP from dirt. Wait, are you serious? Let's go. That's overpowered. I can almost jump a whole block. Ow, I'm taking fall damage when I slip down the dirt, bro. This is so dangerous. Wait, one more level and I'll be able to jump up. You're right. Come on, just a little more. Come on, farm up. I need level three. Yo, I made level three. Wait, I think I'm a normal player right now. Or am I a bit short? I can't even tell anymore. We're definitely shorter than a normal player still. Get me up this block though. Grab my workbench and I'm out of here. Hey, Sonny. Melon, keep your distance. The duel hasn't started. No, I tried to snag it. Yo, give me this wood though. Guys, I realize if we're gonna survive this, we need food. Give me this lemon. Wait, guys, there's a village. I gotta loot it before Sonny finds out. Cross the bridge. Sonny, you need food, you say, huh? Yeah, bro. I got salmons. What do you have? Um, nothing in per se, particularly. I don't really have anything quite yet. Oh, I'm so far behind you, bro. That's so terrible. Why are you acting so sus? Yo, this is an XP farm. Let's go. Then I start mining. Yes, cobblestone. Give me some good loot. I need this to upgrade my gear, guys. I'm gonna get full iron armor, and then I'm gonna melt melt melon in this 1v1. Yeah, give me all that wheat. Now I can craft up some bread. You completely forgot about the village. Wait, there was a village nearby? Yo, give me all this food. Let's go. Dang it, bro. Also, melon, if you get a little too big, you're gonna start to hit your head on blocks. Just warning you. Wait, you're right. I gotta get in the caves before I get too big. Didn't even think about that. You're welcome. That's the last bit of free information I give you. I'm back to a normal player. I'm level four. This is normal Minecraft. Okay, guys, I have a stone axe and a stone pickaxe. I need to monitor my size carefully. I want to go deep into the cave before I 
might get too huge. Otherwise, it's going to be really hard to mine. So two coal pieces is enough. Now we got to go straight down. Sunny, you also get XP from placing blocks. Are you serious? Yeah. Bro, this isn't good. I went into an underwater ravine and now I'm too big to get out. Please let me out of here. Yes, freedom. All right, I'm going to get four pieces of coal. I know that's risky because you get a lot of XP. But now I need to find a better cave system. Yo, I'm so fast. Dude, the bigger you get, the faster you can run. This is epic. I will find the most powerful cave of them all. Wait, Melon, I see you. What are you talking about, bro? I don't know what you're talking about. You've been harvesting some bread, have you? Boom. Yo, chill. You're not allowed to do that, Sonny. No killing yet. You're right. I'm sorry. You want some bread, Sonny? Yeah, I'll take some bread. I'll trade you one slamming. Hey, you can have a potato. I'll take a potato. That's nice. Thank you. Okay, guys. I hope there's a blast furnace in this village. That would be super helpful. Give me these picks. And now it's time to go mining. Yo, I already found some iron. Let's go. What? Are you kidding? Yo, this cave is trash. I'm way too big. I can barely fit in one hole. Blast furnace up here somewhere. Yes. Okay. I didn't find a blacksmith up here, but I did find myself some hay bales. I have bread. No, you weren't supposed to find that bread. Those are my reserves. Yeah, but you left them up the mountainside and your boy is a goaded climber, dude. But you know what else is goaded? Subscribing to our channel. Hit the subscription button in three, two, one. Let's go. Give me that flint. Where is the iron? Oh no, these mobs are giving tons of XP. I'm getting too big too quick. I need to find a cave system with iron. This is not good, boys. I'm getting too big. You're getting too thick, Melon. Sonny, what level are you? Level six. What about you? I'm level eight. Yo, you're going crazy with it. Oh, I just found something pretty nice, though. This is gonna help. As long as I don't die getting down. Ah, no. Whatever, dude. I'm digging. Build myself a two by two. Come on. Where's this iron? Yeah, there it is. Scoop it up. I need maximum resources, and then I'll go track diamonds down. There's a lot of good iron in this cave, Melon. Hey, I grew, and I almost died by teleporting into a wall. You're getting growing pains, Sonny. No. Those were the worst, dude. You'd always get them in your knees, and you'd be like, why is my leg hurting? I just want to sleep. Dude, this is no bueno. No bueno indeed. I'm about to be level 8. I don't want to be bigger. <gasps> just need iron. This is precarious. Precarious. Very precarious. I'm digging straight down, boys. I know we're not supposed to, but what choice do I have? Yes, I hit iron. More iron? Yes, this is beautiful, Melon. My ravine is treating me nicely. No, I can't even fit into those anymore. Yeah, I kind of got a trash ravine. I'm trying to exaggerate it to make myself feel better, but this place pretty much sucks, and now I'm stuck in all these cracks. And what level are you, Sonny? Level eight, but I just found a mountain of iron. I'm level 11, bruh. Dude, you're getting thick. I'm getting too thick for my own good. That's good. Suffocate in the caves, Melon, while I get full iron armor. Yo, this was the biggest iron vein of all time. I need some bread just in case I get suffocated in a wall. There we go. Perfect. And I think it's time I start smelting. We'll take two of those. Place them here. Start cooking. Yo, I finally found something. Come on. I think this is a mine shaft. Come on. What's down here? It is a mine shaft. Let's go. I'm way too big, though. Have fun in your mine shaft, Melon. I've got over 20 iron smelting. No, I only have seven. And now I make this beautiful pickaxe. Dude, I can't fit in here. I'm way too big. I'm not going to be able to get iron. I have to give up on my dream. Dude, you can't even mine iron. You're so dead. I'm going to do a different path here, Sonny. There's only 10 minutes left, and I know just what to do. What's that, bro? Loot? You'll see. Be not goaded? Okay, guys. I'm just gonna completely give up on trying to gather tools and instead get as much XP as possible so that I can outrange Sunny and just hit him from a mile away. I'm gonna spend my limited iron on a shovel and dig the entire world. Okay, guys. It's time for me to craft my secret weapon. One bucket of lava. Just gotta pick this boy up right there. And when it's time to one versus one melon, I'm gonna burn him alive! I've got a lot of iron, actually. Got a chest plate and leggings. 
I look good. Then I make the most overpowered item in Minecraft, the shield. And I'm gonna hold on to that for later. I don't want to equip it right now because it kind of covers half my screen and I'm already too big. And how much iron do I have to spare? Not much. I need to find some more and hopefully I'll even find diamonds. I'm almost level 11. I'm about to grow even bigger. I think I should just dig and try and find a new cave system in here or get really lucky and have diamonds just appear at my feet. They come to me, the beautiful blue. Crafted myself a bucket and a shovel. Now it's time to dig. Get friggin' huge. Come on, open up into diamonds. I have to dig in a two by two now. This is so weird. I think you get even more XP from placing blocks. Yo, check this out. Make me bigger. Be big and strong and Sunny won't be able to stop me. Guys, I'm getting so huge. I could barely fit in the mines now. I need to find diamonds quickly before it's too late. Deeper, maybe? Wait, guys, if I spend this iron right here on some shears, check this out. I'm gonna get XP so quickly. Yes, make me big and strong. I must go deeper. There's gotta be diamonds down here somewhere. Yo, look how far I could strip mine since I'm so huge. I don't see any diamonds there though. Let's try this one. Diamonds, please. I need diamonds. Dang it, gold. That could be big, but I can't even reach it. Ah, it's gonna make a golden apple. There better be some iron in this cliffside. Yes, I'm so big I could just farm iron like this. Give me this iron. Give me it all. Hey, Melon, there's only five minutes left. Yo, chill. That's more than enough time. Yo, harvest all these dandelions. Come on. There's gotta be diamonds here somewhere. Yo, gonna cut this beehive up. Yo, what you gonna do, bees? What you gonna do? I'm too big for you. You can't even touch me. Now I'm just gonna slaughter some bees. Yes, give me the XP. Guys, this is so bad. If I just move a little bit right now, I'm taking damage. This better be worth it. Come on. Yo, it was worth it. Let's go. Wait, I'm too big. I can't even reach it. No, I gotta make my hole bigger somehow. Ow, ow. I'm actually taking hits. I'm taking too much damage. How am I supposed to grab these diamonds? Melon, I found diamonds, but I can't reach them. You found diamonds, bro? I'm bringing them up. You raised me up. So I could get these diamonds. Oh, wait, I'm stuck in a hole now. Ow! This cave is actually giant. It might be able to support me. Yo, there's so much iron. Give me this iron. Yes, give it to me. Oh, no, these skeletons. Yo, there's so many creepers. Yo! How am I supposed to get out of here? Can I build up? Ow! I can't build up. Yo, this is too much sauce. No! I'm too big. Give me this iron. I can farm a few more. Yes. No. Wait, I can just run back there instantly. I have to let the mines take me. Just take me. Thank you. I'm free. Yo, I'm huge. Melon, I'm bigger than Gort. Gort is so puny. I stomp on his head. Hey, Sonny. Hey, Melon. You're pretty big too, bro. What's your level, bro? 16. You're only level 16? <laughs> You little tiny boy. You're huge. Oh my gosh. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, I need to craft this, guys. That'll make me stronger. That's good. And I have a little bit of iron left. I guess I should do this. Okay, I at least have boots. And I got my secret weapons. The shield and the lava bucket. Okay, guys, I gotta go back to that cave and farm up some more iron. I'm gonna smelt fish because that's a better food source for combat. I don't really know what to do now, Melon. Uh, I guess I just start breaking blocks or something. Nah, uh, you won't want to do that, bro. Why would you want to do that? You said you get XP for placing blocks. You're right. This is insane. Yo, chill, Sonny. Chill. I'm leveling up, bro. Leveling up. Give me this iron. I don't want to have to deal with stupid creepers. Level me up. Melon, you want to show me where that iron is? I could use some more. No. Wait, can I do this? Did I find a hack, guys? Yes, I'm a cheater. Let's go. What did you do, Sonny? Sunny. Yo, I could find diamonds in this cave. There's gotta be diamonds here somewhere. Yeah, you find diamonds. Listen to this sweet sound, though. Bro, what are you doing? Do you hear that? That's the sound of me permanently leveling up. What do you mean? I'm hacking the game. I'm a cheeser. Oh, I cheesed too hard. Hold on. Give me all this iron. I'm too big. I go back to cheesing. I need an auto clicker for this. My hand hurts. What did you do? It's my secret. I got enough iron. I gotta get out of here now. Kill me, skeleton. Bruh, I'm almost 23. Level up fast. What are you doing? Oh. oh, what? What? No, chill. You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. What 
you doing, bro? Are you going like this? You going like this, huh? Give me my sugar cane. This is mine. That's it? That's that's your technique? That's my secret. Stay away from it. Give me that, boy. Wait, this might be a better technique. You get no XP for this. This is garbage. I was gonna farm seaweed. Come to me, my fish. I need cooked salmon. Yes. I have enough iron for iron armor. Wait, I'm one iron short. I gotta go back out. Melon. I now bake that potato you gifted me, and it will be the difference maker. This will be how I defeat you in one-on-one -on -one combat. Also, you only have two minutes left. My baked potato is prepared and ready for battle. Okay, guys, I now have enough iron to make myself some pants and make myself that axe. Guys, I'm just spamming for level 24. I want to be at least level 24. Yes, we've done it. Maybe I go for level 25. 25 sounds like a nice number. Comment down below what level you think I should go for. Guys, I gotta place these leaves down. And that's level 25. Yo, Melon, you are huge, bruh. Sonny, I had just enough iron for one little thing. Check this out. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Give me all this XP! Yo, chill! I'm out of iron. I can't even make shears. Yes! Wait, scale the mountain. There might be more iron up here. Where's the iron? Come on. It's gotta be here somewhere. Give me all the XP. Yes, I will become the biggest in all the lands. I found iron, Melon. You won't be the biggest. Not bigger than me. I'm going all the way up, Sonny. You don't even know what I'm about to do. I don't even want to know. You're crazy, dude. Where is more iron on the mountains? There's gotta be more here somewhere. Yes, there is. Give me this. I need a helmet. I need to protect my noggin. Sonny, one minute left. That's plenty of time, bro. I just gotta find my furnace. What are you doing? What, bro? I'm just building a sky tower. I have the countermeasure. Yeah, you build that, bro. You build that. You build that. Come on. Hurry up. Why is it not catching it? There's another way. Start smelting. Yes, it worked. It's burning. Melon has no idea. His leaf tower is on fire. I now have a leaf sky base. Yeah, nice one, bro. Really nice. You're gonna farm that for experience? No, why would I do that? Oh, I thought you were gonna farm that and just get huge. Okay, guys, the lava stopped burning the leaves for some reason, but I have iron and I have flint and now I have a flinted steel. Let's go. Burn this stupid tower down. I ran out of leaves, unfortunately. Well, Melon, leave me out of it. Come on, quicker. Hey, Melon, look at the bottom of your tower, bro. I can't see the bottom of my tower, Sonny. Oh, that's okay. Soon there won't be a bottom of your tower. Did you light it on fire? It's all burning. No, chill. Wait, I can just place a cobblestone down. Oh, also the fire stopped spreading. So you're okay up there. Really? Yeah, really. No joke, no cap. Biggest water bottle clutch. Water bottle. Wow, I've never heard of a water bottle clutch. That's news to me. Uh, all right, so I need the time's up. In 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Where's our referee? Where's Gort? Why is Gort in this tree? Melon, what did you do? Bro, what is up with this tree? What is it even made out of? Gort's mangrove forest has grown to be big and strong, and now it's on fire. Yo, chill. That's Gort's home. Okay, Gort, are we ready to start fighting? Melon, he said yes. He said, may the best job giant goat win. Hold on, let's see who's bigger. You a little tiny boy, Sonny. You a tiny boy! Ow! But I have this. Yeah, we'll see what wins. You ready? I'm ready, dude. Let the one versus one of the century commence! Let's go! You're trash. Oh no, look at this. I got that range advantage. I'm too big! You think you can run? Ah! I'm eating the baked potato! This will make all the difference! I just like to play with my food. Hey, Sonny, you think you can run for me? Huh? Yes, I can! Ow, chill! Oh, the good thing I can get in water. <laughs> That's fine. Hey, chill! Oh my god! Oh, you're so slow. I knew my strategy would pay off. I don't even need armor against you. Ow! Ow! Yeah? You sure? Get back here. Yo, what you gonna do? I'm gonna block. I broke your shield. You don't even have an axe to break my shield. You're such a noob. No! Get destroyed. That was so unfair. You can hit me from farther away than I could hit you. Yep, I knew range would make me win in this battle, Sonny. Hey, Sonny. Oh, you're so close to hitting me. Ow! 
Get wrecked, bro. Best two out of three. Scores one to one. Just give me a second, okay? There's something I forgot at my base. Yo, I'm putting back on my armor, bro. I'm not taking it easy. I'm gonna squash you this round. Okay, guys. Melon thinks he's gonna destroy me. But I've got something else planned. XP add, big man Sunny. I think like this much should probably be enough. Huh? I think I might have crashed the game. That's too many levels. I need to remove my XP. I'll be right back. I'm here! Huge! Level 100! Let's go! Melon, you ready to settle this beef? Yep, I'm ready to squash you, Sonny. Meet me in spawn. Alright, I'm on the way. <laughs> yeah, here's spawn. What the heck are you, bro? I left some experience over in my base, bro. Who are you gonna squash? Who? Uh, I gotta get in close, guys. He's so big. He's so quick. No, he has an axe, too. Get in! Oh, my God. Yeah, that shield is gone and no please i can still do this i'm gonna light you on fire go back go back here nah you're doing damage to me i don't appreciate that i gotta back up and eat my slamming where are you just disappeared you just vanished this is attack on titan melon i'm too big where are you sonny i can't see you you're out of my render distance he swoops in and he dips you didn't even hit me bro i'm coming back for you sonny get stuck on the trees oh i'm pretty fast too ow hey ow it's hard to control this. Come here. I need to retreat. This is proving that size isn't everything. Let me back. Yo, I'm coming for you, Sonny. I'm stuck in these trees. Retreat in the caves. Oh, I can't fit in that cave. The battle of the giants. Where are you, Sonny? Sneak up on him and whack him. Yo, what the heck? I'm all powerful. And then I thwomp him. Get back here. You're gonna die this time. Bro, no, I won't fall. Move. I lost him. I'm too quick with it. You're so fast, Sonny. Hey, Melon. Hey, buddy. Come here. Yeah, that's your shield gone. Yeah, run for me. No. Chill. That's your shield. Yeah, get wrecked. Eat my bread. Yeah. Chill. Chill. We hungry giants. We get hungry quick. Get back here. How are you alive? I gotta go. I'm stuck in a tree. Get out of here. Get back here. No. What the heck? You keep running, you coward. Melon, I am no coward. Burn him. Oh, no. That's, that love is so gonna hit me, Sonny. No, I'm stuck. Where are you? Nowhere to be seen ever again until I regenerate. Because I have one heart. This was too close. I'm so confused. Let's keep it that way. I'm turning my render distance all the way up. Yeah, have fun with that. 32 chunks. Now I can see you from anywhere. Hey! I'm right behind you. That's my trick. You will not lava a bucket me. I will lava a bucket you. Hey! Ow! Yeah, that's right. Run, you coward how much health do you have i don't understand i was at like one heart there i won't lie and he swoops in ow yes no yes melon the giant slayer oh that was so satisfying i couldn't move around properly let's get stuck on all the trees i just wanted to put you in lava and roast you bro i guess the bigger they are the harder they fall gg melon i'll give you props for that congratulations on becoming the goat let's go yo chill chill you don't want this yeah you sure one heart in the dream one heart in no now make sure you guys like and subscribe for more epic minecraft